just cruel us But inside your wires lie a million mortal flaws Electric sleep I dream inside my honeycomb I stay alive inside my hive of skin and chrome Broken body built anew Spirit linkers torn in two Metal fingers grip my heart so cold Fossil fuels to slavery Political duplicity Every great commodity has been sold Slave to the new black gold There's a heartbeat under my skin Search my electric soul For the hidden man within Slave to the new black gold There's a heartbeat Search my electric soul for the hidden man within Okay. If I don't look where I'm going, I fall off. Yeah. The, um, yeah, there's, there's a jump there. Um, yeah, so he, I swear he was in the middle of one of the puzzles. So, the story, the saga of the, um, Sertaf, or whatever we're calling this big stone hieroglyphic thing, seems to be something to do with a crystal that people are harvesting. They created some kind of gate. I thought originally it was the clone portal, but I don't know, because there's half of the stone missing. So I'm not sure if, you know, there's anything here. You know what? I'm just going to start this. How long have you got? Just because I'm going to take forever on this. Uh, and you're going to come about in half and, a percent. and you know. Okay, well then uh, I'm just going to have a look what's going on. Yeah. But I figure, you know, last time I managed to do two thirds of a puzzle while you did an entire one and then caught up to me. So I figure if I, if I have a start, then we're good. Okay. Um, okay. So, two teleporters, a cube, um, thank you for the retweet, Yuki. Two teleporters, a cube, um, I'm going to just teleport to the switch. Teleport is useful. Okay, so that... Does that go all the way in? So, can I put a teleport on that would be the question. And we can see what is the answer. Um, okay, so let's just record this off on this button. So we will be joined by Jesse on his screen at the moment. He is knowing... No, he's streaming. He seems to be streaming. He's streaming a stream. I'm starting to get down to the challenge mode levels for lawn mowing sim. And they're usually like timing and fuel challenges. Okay, so... Right, but this one there. had a lot for, um, was apparently very tight with the penalties. Okay, why did we might just fall down with it? That was silly. Okay. And uh, we had a lot of penalties. Penalties on the, on the lawn? What? Apparently I was running into, I was running into the Royal Stones a bit too much. Oh no. I know. Oh, That's really rude. Right, I um, did a silly, so I'm using myself off here. Right. 
da 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 Right, it doesn't go in, so we're just going to go across. And then we're gonna plonk teleporter. Down here. So we can half inch the cube. Right. Okay, we have a cube. I press the button, it's going to reset everything and not just the teleporters. So I don't want to do that. Okay. So. No, we don't want two teleporters on the platform. We need to get onto that platform somehow. I'm not immediately seeing a solution. I can't have half of the thing. So even if it was on there, it wouldn't make a difference because when that was across there, the other one is up. We need it to be down. I really don't see how this one's going to work. Okay, I'm just going to check resetting. It resets everything. Yeah, it resets everything. So it resets the cube. Okay. That's not useful. Do that. We grab this, we grab the cube and we teleport. Okay, so now we have a cube. The teleporter down there. That's not useful. My brain cannot work its way around this one. What are your thoughts? Still kind of struggling.
Getting the block, you have to sacrifice the teleporter. Exactly. What you doing? Thinking. What you doing? Looks like you're looking down, so I thought you were doing something else. <laughs> no, I was sort of staring at your stream, hoping it would be inspiring. I tried to use the teleporter as a, a button thing before as well. Well, I know it can't trigger the the platform, so. Maybe the block is some sort of, you know, fake, fake out. We don't need the block. And it's there just to trick us. Maybe this is like the bridge thing all over again. Really, 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 yes, Dan. getting very confused. Can I pick up? But yes, hey Dan. I'm wondering if I can do that fake thing like we did with the block. Um, we did win the, we yeah, I saw what you just did. It sort of didn't work. Mm 
like, you know, pretending to... I don't know whether I've actually picked it up or not. No, it just seems to be... Because you know how we did the thing with the block on the bridge? Where as long as we moved the bridge before she before the clone picked up the block, they still did the thing. Or she, I want to say she because you know I think it's a female. Do you feel like I've got the right idea? It's an idea, but it doesn't use the block at all, and I'm wondering if that matters. But as you said, if we use the block, we sacrifice the teleport. And I know why not in that in my current setup. Hmm? Okay, right, hang on. I don't think I'm putting it down. God, it worked. You have to wait until the clones picked it up when they're running, but also then stun on the button. But you do need the block. <laughs> However, um, however, 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 I that took the teleport across. What? What do you mean you didn't need the block? Oh. Right. Yeah. But it's fine, because as, as long as you leave the teleporter at the top, then when you, you get the block last. Yep. <sighs> so we had it. We had it. We did it. I nearly did a thing then. Nearly did a thing. Ah. Yeah, nearly fell off the platform having set all that up. Okay, so now we got to fix a bridge. Easy. Hey, Dad, are you coming out of this cave? Probably not. Okay, so there's the broken bit, and here's like a whole section here where obviously we've got to do some nonsense. This does not look fun. I see a wheel. You see a wheel? Ah, wheel. cool. I see a wheel too. Okay, I see two transporters. I see a burb. We have to go say, say hi to the burb. <gasps> the burb is wearing a little a little sweatshirt that has is is BZ. It's BZ the burb. Um um kuchi 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 kuchi. <gasps> the burb. <gasps> oh, he's easy. Yeah. The leg is wearing a little sweatshirt. It's so cute. I 
took a screenshot. Um, right, okay, I got distracted by the burp. Uh, so there's no way that goes up here. Um, okay, maybe... Well, the easiest way is go bloink, 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 and then see what's up here. Okay, so there's a button up here which makes that... Oh, right. Ah, hello. Okay. Okay, right. Thanks, Leaking. Okay, so that makes that come up. So, we have to... Hang on. Right, I should have left that teleporter up there. Okay, so... Okay. Gotta use the clone for this, right? Otherwise, I'm gonna end up with a problem. Okay, I'm guessing that got knocked off. Yeah, those platforms are too low. They're scrapers. Uh-huh. Um... Yeah, but the problem is, where did my other teleporter go? <laughs> uh, I think it fell into the void somewhere. Um, it got scraped, okay, so it fell off, yes. Yeah, I know, but the trouble is that you can't really get across quick enough, can you? I suppose clone again? It's got to be some sort of cloning, I'm guessing. Um, so clone stands on one, I stand on the other. Got across. Okay. But I'm gonna find out if we actually need pieces. Yeah, I got across too. Um I wanna have a look at this wheel. It is just a wheel. I pressed the button and then it just... Yeah, it went cutscene. Cutscene, yes. I will wait at the great gate. Well, that was easy then. Huh? Okay. 
Okay, so that just worked? Yeah. All we had to do was get across that single gap. Ah. Mm -hmm. I know, right? I feel like, you know. A little anticlimactic? Yeah, how do we get back though? Uh, there's a, that movable platform that you're currently activating. But that goes to the other side of the... It's fine, drop down yeah. and then the cave. It's the other side of the broken bridge. Oh yeah, cool. Yes, the, the door, of course. Yes, thank you. <sighs> there was a platform, of course I was going to activate it. I was just, uh, hang on a minute, how are we going to do this thing? I think we have to do the special door first. Before the Great Pyramid. What do you mean? Sorry. We have to go under the special door before we go to uh, return the final seal, I think. Okay, well, we've still got to put them, make them purple, right? Yes. I'm just okay. saying we go to the, the super special purple door before we go to the Great yes. Pyramid to return the snake. Or Otherwise, the story ends? I don't want to... I don't know. I just wouldn't want to risk it. <laughs> That's fine. Yeah, I understand. But totally not storyline if it's missable. <laughs> Um, I had to change which I'm doing for my 35G achievement because I ran into a level in Shift Quantum that I can't currently do. No? Yeah, I spent half an hour trying to jump and it just won't jump the way I want it to jump. So I'm now playing uh, Lacuna and I'm going to get Chunky Boy <laughs> oh, okay. by feeding my lizard, which just means it's just it's a little bit of extra story. So while you're streaming after this, I am going to... Um, um, okay, so five crystals de deposited. Uh, we go, hang on. The door that opened was the one that we need. There wasn't an extra door. We just go back in this rainy hole, right? Yeah. And reinvert the pyramid. Yes. Cool. So, yeah, so I'm doing a speed run of Lacuna to get to the part where I unlock the achievement. Uh, <laughs> and then um, I will get my Joanne achievement. Because, you know, why not? How did he get back? What do you mean? I didn't see him go with us. He's clearly like some kind of teleporting alien pretending to be our dad. Because he uh, was dan doing a dance on top of that thing in the middle that no one could have got to, so... And why did he need our help to get past the bridge? Um... Don't point out the holes in my plan, Jesse. Okay. I just, you know, I wasn't sure. <laughs> maybe he couldn't teleport that way. Or maybe he needed us to do the thing. Because he couldn't do the thing. He needed us to get the seal because he's a ghost and can't get it. Um, so therefore he needed to pretend to need our help. Well, I went to the door. Turn. And there's a platform okay. that goes down. Splat. Okay, this door this door is open. Okay, so right. Uh, yeah, there's a there's a big purple thing. Are you going on the purple thing? Yeah. You, you step on the, on the center of the disc and you end up down below. Ooh, spooky. Yes, this is not a normal stream. This is this is a Wednesday stream because I wanted to Oh, hello, bleep bloop. Um Wait, what? what it says yet though. I got a bloop. Oh, it didn't show up on my screen, but I got it. No, neither did I. Secret cave. It showed up on my PC, but not on my... I'm not on the game. I'm gonna go with... There's possibly some API issues everywhere today. So the last achievement should be the snake. I'm guessing. Okay. That are all the puzzles. So, possibly. Depends whether there are puzzles... Um, I'm going towards the glowing statue on the right. Yeah, there's a lot of names on coffins, and I'm wondering if these are, like, Kickstarter backers. Oh, bloody hell, that looks scary. Like, yeah, these look like Kickstarter naming. Okay. The, the, the Kickstarter naming graveyard. 
Well, Saket, Apophis, Horus, Ptah, Tefnut. These are those are Egyptian gods. Then you've got Sebastian Dabot, forty-two eighty-nine France. Yeah, that sounds like a. That's my point. Is like they could have put whatever they yeah. wanted. So like somebody could have put Horus. Frank, I found Frank. Um, yeah, but the first line that I looked at were definitely Egyptian gods. Yeah, uh, Rashida, Thaber, Osiris, Bastet, and then DK one three three seven. Yeah, I'm guessing they that <laughs> some of the more serious names, while they they are technically Egyptian gods type theming, like. I'm sure some people thought, I'll just put my name as an Egyptian god and we'll make it even more weird. Yeah, we've got Robert Ra. Harati. Clearly just making it Egyptian. And then Fizzle. Yeah. Okay, so anyway, rather than getting distracted by all these glowing coffins, I appreciate the people who have backed them. If I backed it, I would go, but basically the giant glowy thing is nothing. Yep. Right, so there should be puzzles under here, right? Looks like it's on the other side. Really wish there was a run button. Yeah, but that would other break side. the difficulty of some of the other puzzles. Oh, I know, but maybe just during, like, the non... You know, the, the just where you're getting to other places. Okay, right. Da -da 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 -da. I see glowing... Oops, splat. I didn't jump properly. Right, I see two teleporters and a cube. I see a button and a platform. Okay, so if we do that, that goes here. And that switches places. Okay. So that's not really helpful. Unless we can somehow... Do... Uh, maybe that's the case of we get a teleporter over that way somehow. Um, but then what activates that up there? What's activating that? Does that move at the same time? No. What, so what activates that one? Hmm. We don't have a squiz. This glowy thing is activated by some shit up there. Okay. So, if we can somehow get a teleporter over to that side, then we can get a cube up here. And I'm assuming then, yes. Then that goes across there. Okay. Uh, and this takes forever, so it definitely needs a cube on it. Um, but also, that is a really long way around. What are you thinking? Not sure if we even want the... I almost wonder if we want teleporters. What, two teleporters over? Because that's not really going to work, right? Maybe we do. No, we do want teleporters. We need teleporters and the cube. Possibly. Oh, okay, um, 
breaking my brain on this one. Um, so I need to be on the button. All that does is give my clone a dread, a ride. I don't even know what we're what we're gonna get out of this. Um, so I'm thinking somehow. Oh god, you know how I get this to work? I put a fucking thing on there. Okay. Okay, well, I've got the cube over here. Oh! Yeah, I don't, I'm, don't need to overcomplicate it. Teleport on the platform, send the platform all the way over, go back and stand on the other teleporter. <sighs> Definitely no need to overcomplicate. thing I need not to do is fall in when I do the jump. Watch me fall in when I do the jump. Nope, I did not fall in. Uh, we've got a different problem anyway. We need the cube. Okay. But it was half a good idea. So we do need the other teleporter. Okay. Um. Okay. So. The other teleporter over. Stupid okay, wimpy I'm... jump. Sorry? Stupid wimpy jump button when I hold stuff. What happened? You can't jump far with stuff in your hands. No, you can't. <laughs> Which is why I always inevitably fall over trying to make stuff lop over a gap. Um. Okay. Ah! Oh, well, that's reset the puzzle, didn't it? Thanks for that. I really wanted to fall in by accidentally going backwards off a thing. That was great. 10 out of 10. Totally would do that again. At the very least, I need to get the cube over. 
So let's reset it so we've got that maybe. Okay. Nope. Okay, right, minimum of one teleporter. Okay, so we need to get the other teleporter over and also the cube. So do I take the cube first? In which case, how do I get the teleporter over? Because I kind of can't replicate that trick, can I? Um, because I've not got the teleporter anymore. Um, any ideas? Maybe you can. Okay. Maybe you can. All right. Okay. How? Oh, that's not going to be quick enough. So, we're able to get one plat one teleporter on the low platform, on the low mover. The one that goes over to the other side, yes. Yeah. And a cube. And we could put the cube there as well. Yeah. But the problem is when we get the thing over to the other side, it's like, oh, oops, uh, we need a cube to get up. But we also need the cube to hold down the button because it takes the freaking ever. So therefore we need two teleporters on that side, right? I think, yeah? Or is there a way to do it without? Because there's no way to dive off that platform and there's literally one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14. You're already over well. 15 seconds, exactly. The thing There's lasts the maybe 10. Yeah, I, I put it to about time. 10 on my count. Yeah, exactly. I was just counting how long it was, so I was doing a slow count. And then it's a good solid more than 10 to get over. So we do need the teleporter because once that over, then we can clone, pick up the cube, and teleport. So we do need that other teleporter. How do we get the other teleporter over without the cube and the teleporter is the question. And also I'm totally going to put that teleporter more in the center of the thing. Because if I fall backwards off this effing thing again, I am going to scream at it. Um. So we can send the teleporter over there. That's great. And then we can clone. And then we have absolutely no way of getting... Um, 
unless we teleport over here. Oh god, if I get on there, I'm going to be screwed. Okay, so if I got on there... try something because it can't help but hurt can't can't oh no 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 okay, i know how to I'm do it the off again. i know how to do it he's gone but i figured it out Well, I know what you don't do. You don't fall off the stupid jump. Um, you figured out how to do it. Yep. What, get both teleporters over? Yep. Okay. With only one teleporter. Yeah. I think so. So if I reset it up how it was... Oh, you've not done it yet, okay. Because I died. Ah. Cool. Yeah, that's what I did, but I died accidentally. Or not really died, but something analogous. you grab you okay so i've got both the teleporters assuming... i just don't have a cube now ah okay so how so you needed the cube to get the teleporter across potentially no but you, you did then so how did you do that okay so the object you want to transport oh my giddy on a stupid fucking jump sorry i fell off again <laughs> i'm sorry yeah, tell, tell me good. while i'm setting it up again <laughs> I hate this. I hate this. Is not a platformer, but it really should, you know, not punish you for not being able to jump. Sorry. Okay. So... How, how did you do? <laughs> Ooh, how am I gonna do this one? Hmm? I'm trying to think how I'm gonna get the cube now. Okay, well, tell me tell me how you did a single teleporter with a cube, and maybe we can figure something out. So, you're able to get the, the teleporters to where it's like one on each, right? Right, I have, I have one teleporter on the slow-ass platform. And I'm taking, I'm not taking over the cube. Okay, so I've got one teleporter on either side of the bridge. Okay, so put one on each of the, the movers. What do you mean, one on each of the movers? So, like, you've got oh, one so on the... put it on the slow platform. Put it on the the one that goes in the middle. Yeah, put it on the mover ones, the ones that we're currently worried about. Okay, the left and the right ones. Yep. Okay. Right, okay, so we call one and two, and then there's a the big fat three. Okay, so yeah. we're putting them on one and two, right? Yep. Okay. 
Okay, so put the... What I did was I dropped the block on the switch. Okay. I started a recording and then put the, the recording on the moving platform going out. But before it got to the end, I picked up the the teleporting disc. Yep. And then I just stood there in the corner. Then when I restarted myself, I waited for my copy to pick up the disc, and then I picked up the box, and that would make sure that the platform was coming back, but that the both discs would end up on platform two. Yes. Okay, cool. But that still doesn't help me get the block. No, oh, I realize that. And... This time, I realized exactly why I died. And it was only partially my fault. And mostly just blame the very, very, very bad jumping physics in this game. Uh... <laughs> But I'm wondering if I can rearrange that idea a little bit further. Yeah, what I mean, that's originally really what I was trying to figure out. Like, riding the platform. Um, just doing it with, like, one teleporter. Okay, reset that up. I have one platform with two teleporters on. Yeah, that's as far as I got. Okay. This is tricky. This is tricky. Tricky, tricky, tricky. Wanka, 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 tricky. Tricky, 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 tricky. Wanka, 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 tricky.
Okay, I'm gonna reset. Got any ideas? Um, half an idea. Okay. I'm just gonna get it. I'm just gonna get it set up with the one teleporter on the other side first. Um. I'm definitely confident that we need at least one on each side. Yeah. happens if what happens if clone me puts that on there picks up that and then drops it in the corner and then Ah, that was too quick. Did you bring that back? Thank you. Oh no, wait, that's not what I wanted to do. Right, now I've got two teleporters over, but it was... Right, I think... I think I've got it half figured. So... Do half and half. As normal. Then, bring it back, start a recording, place the box down, then before it goes away, grab the other one, but gives yourself enough time that when... Oh, nearly. Okay, you need to give yourself enough time to get on the teleporter before your clone picks it up. Because once again, I've now got two teleporters on the other side. I don't want that. I need to be... You'll probably be better at doing this than me. So, yeah. I see what you're saying. You see what I'm saying? Okay, good. Yeah. Because we, we sort of need the box to do it, to get the teleporter over, but also we need the box to be on the other side. And I'm like, well, why can't we do both? Um... I don't know whether this is going to work timing-wise, but it's worth a shot. And then I realise we've still got another teleporter to do, so, you know, bear with me on that.
question is, am I giving myself enough time? Yes! Did it work? Is the other teleporter on there? Yes! Okay, right. So I've got one teleporter on platform two. One teleporter near three. The cube is over. Now I just need to figure out... Right, what do I need to do? I need to be able to get round to here to pick up that. So... What if I... Point myself, do the jump, stamp the button. And then half inch it, half inch it? Leg it, leg it round. I got it! I was just watching your, your stream and it just was inspirational, basically. Um... Did that make sense, what I was babbling? Yeah. Gotta... Not repeating it. <laughs> I will die jumping if, I, if I'm not careful. Oh my god. <laughs> I almost nobbled the jump. <laughs> Ooh, I see a, a center. I'm gonna wait for you there. Yes, I nearly nobbled that jump. That would have been embarrassing. Um, Alright, so I'm gonna have some tea. This is the second teleporter. Okay, so you need to record before you put the thingy down? Yes, I realize. <clears throat> yeah, okay, cool. I'm just checking. Yeah, you need to give yourself a little bit more time on me picking it up. Took me about five goes before I got the timing right. Oh, but you managed to at least reset yourself better. I ended up having to reset the whole thing. Because <laughs> I dropped the cube on me. What do you call it? Oops. There's probably more puzzles. Maybe there's a puzzle behind the snake door. <gasps> you did it. Drop. Cool. Right, now you need to go to the bridge. But before you jump over the bridge, record. But before you... Okay, that also works. 
I did it before I jumped mm. because I don't trust my jumping. <laughs> <laughs> I definitely did it before because I don't trust my jumping. I just left the cube on the platform. Because <laughs> you don't actually need it for the button. But, um... Okay. Mm. Deceptive. But across. It's fine with the way you... You're across. You're across. Okay, cool. Awesome. Right. Yeah, I almost fell in the drink after having done that, and I was very annoyed. Excuse me? Excuse me? I have the hiccups. Ooh, okay, so we've got... <gasps> Ghost person. Offering an hourglass. Prophecy. Okay, so the apparently so solve all puzzles just popped. Yeah. For me, it didn't. It, it popped invisibly. Yeah, I had an invisible um, pop. Okay, so basically. And there's just a platform going back up. There's just a platform going back up. Yeah. That was it. Oh, I guess it was the Kickstarter area, but. So that's totally missable then, potentially. We'll have to see when we've put the snake thing in whether we could go back through that door. But hey, that was just over an hour. So yes, if we'd have continued to do that last night, it would have been like 1 a.m. for me. And honestly, I'm not sure I could have solved that particular one. Um, right. Big glowy ass door. And dear old dad. Right. Just waiting to be betrayed. This is it. The biggest mystery of ancient Egypt. Hi, Dad. Did you change clothes? Were you wearing green before? No turning back after we insert the final seal. Do it when you are ready. I mean, clearly, I'm ready, you know. It's the biggest mystery of Egypt. I'd forgotten we were in Egypt, you know, after having make joke, made jokes about cemitaphs and stuff. I don't know why achievements aren't popping up, but if it's not happening for me as well, then I'm assuming it's some sort of outage. There we go, the snake. So now I am 60G away. I just have to get Chunky Boy in the Kuna and then my Joanne achievement, and I'll be ready for the stream tomorrow. I'm going to pre-prep it before the stream and show everyone my pretty, pretty gamer score. Um, and then I think after that, I don't know whether I'm going to hit any other milestones. That may be a million, you know, in like four years' time. <laughs> Will not be four I, years. Did you, did you hit a million? I can't remember. I mean, I've I don't know what you passed a million. You passed a million. Um, oh I think I hit it on the dot. I couldn't remember what game of score you had, that's why. Um, okay. That was it. So yeah, the solvable puzzles and visit the underground bit is missable. I mean, we'll have to see what happens after you get through the cuts. The, the credits, yeah. Yeah, okay. But yeah, it's like, it's not really storyline, it's deceptive, but yes, we are now on. Um, why does this app not actually show my gamer score? Seven 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 one seven. 
60 away. So yeah, it's not happening in Shift Quantum anytime soon without me throwing things. Um, because, yeah. I watched a video to see how you do it. And basically it's like, pull this block, then jump up to the left, and then jump up to the right. And I'm just not quick enough. So I'm going to mark that one as me finishing. <laughs> but I can get Chunky Boy and Lacuna probably in like an hour or so. And then yes, I'll get my Joanne achievement, and I'll have 77777. And I'll be very happy. Okay, so the Kickstarter backer thing is <clears throat> probably the high tier people who there's the yeah. special tier to get yeah. a gravestone in the special area. Yes. Oh yes, you have uh you have over a million and a quarter. <laughs> over a million and a third. Over a million and a third. Oh yes, exactly. Did you did did you get one three 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 seven to be very elite? No. <laughs> oh, that would have been funny. Um, what I was surprised about was that I have a gamer score than Dan. Really? And that confused me. Yeah. He's got all that he's ratio got, stuffs. He's not even got hit three quarters of a million yet, but his ratio and completion percentage is like way higher than mine. But I was really surprised. Honestly, I figured, you know, Dan would be uh, better than me, but apparently I'm better than Dan. <laughs> I'm joking. He's probably gone to walk the dog, so he's not even hearing it. <laughs> or he's listening and he's going to put something in the chat that's going to be scathing. <laughs> I don't know. I am just ad-libbing now because there is a lot of Kickstarter backers. We're almost the end. Yeah, I'm at T. <laughs> Dan is listening. Apparently I'm a cheeky monkey. Three of eight. There's a, that's one. And then Tezumo. I don't know why that's not... That, the fact that that is one key bugs me. Pat Nugan. Uh, ben, thanks. Patrick, thanks. There's a lot of people called thanks. Maybe it's like a family that did this? Oh my god. <laughs> There's also a Frank, thanks. That must be the dad. <laughs> You're terrible. I'm kidding. I'm kidding. But it was worth it. It was a dad joke, right? Okay. Well, they're definitely not storyline, those two. But they could potentially be not missable. We'll see. So you hit continue. And I'm pretty much right where we were at that point. Before going into the temple. Right. Okay. So not storyline, but also not missable. Yeah. And technically, if you... Go into the pyramid again... Does it work? Because you don't have the, the little it, snake anymore. Yeah, it does. Apparently it just knows that you're supposed to have it at that moment in time. Okay, cool. If you step okay, on the blue so circle, it'll work again. Yeah, I'm not going to step in the glowy circle. Okay, so that is 10 out of 10. Yeah, I don't know the if it deserves a 10. My gamer score on my Xbox says... 777417, but the gamer score on my app says, so, makes me think that something's gone a little wonky with APIs and I'm slightly concerned. <sighs> yeah. Um, that's not right. <laughs> my, 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 my profile is wrong. <laughs> uh, <laughs> um, okay. Why does it have to do this to me when I hit nearly hit a milestone? Okay, well, hopefully it'll have sorted itself out by tomorrow. <sighs> it shows correctly on mine. Yes, it shows correctly on my app. No, like, but... on my console right now. Yes. Um... 
I see seven 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 one seven. And what's your gamer score? One three six two seven nine nine. Okay, I've got one three six two nine nine nine. And then you. TA's got one three six three zero nine nine, so it is off. Yeah. Okay. So it's not just me. Um Yeah, it's off by it three hundred, even matter. though it shows Yeah, so this is not technically right. I'll do a reset of my Xbox. I'm not doing there's no way I'm gonna end up with an eight on the end leaky. I've painstakingly added this up. The only problem will be if I end up with you know, seven 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 four seven seven because the stupid thing hasn't synced to my three hundred gamer score, and that would be irritating. But it's okay. I've I, I've got to just got to do it tomorrow before the stream, and I'll do a full restart to see if that. But I'm going with there's probably some API issues because Twitch was having issues, and I'm assuming there's some sort of generic internet outage somewhere. Um. Uh. But anyway, <laughs> the internet is. Who? Are you staying on, Jesse? Did you say? Yeah, no, I'm gonna keep going, but I'll be okay. right back. Well, okay, we're gonna go raid Jesse. Ooh, we can shout out. All right, let's see if the shout out thing works, just because I want to try it. Shout out was given to Leaky. Okay, well, I just see Leaky's name like that. I don't. Thing. It's supposed to have like a button. Only one shout out can be active at a time. Uh, okay, so it's not terribly useful. Anyway, I'm gonna raid Radical Sniper 99. And I'll be right back. And he'll be right back. And if you wanna put the raid message in, um, you can, because why not? No one knows we're coming. But anyway, that's the end of Hourglass. Thank you very much, everyone, for putting up with that last bit. Hopefully, it was only an hour and a little bit. Um, but we're done, and yes, hopefully we can resync our gamer score and hit the target tomorrow. I'll be back tomorrow at eight. For now, we're going to uh, raid Jesse. So I've been Joe, otherwise known as Angel SK. Goodbye. Ah, okay. So now, I wonder if I'm on the B right back. So, can everyone hear me? Uh, maybe we can have some fun while Jesse is away. If no one can hear me, then that is less fun. Uh, so if you can hear me, do you have to say something? Uh, it's a Joe. Okay, so Jesse has gone. We are going to have a little bit of fun. We're totally going to have fun because I am a good person that does not do dodgy things on my friend in the stream. However, we are going to hail the chair. Almighty chair, hail, hail, hail the chair. We have chair hype. And also shout out to Lord Alucard for the gorgeous, gorgeous art. Um, so, yeah. Okay, slightly risque art. But I feel like this was inspired by me saying you should totally have a be right back screen with Jesse draw me like one of your French girls. Um, he does have very pretty eyes though. <laughs> but yes, chair hype. Yes, shout out to Jesse for the shredded abs. Um, very much so. Has the little logo on, which is kind of sweet. Um, so yes. Well, when the the cat's away, the mice will play type thing. Uh, I'm just going to restart my console while I am vamping, ad libbing, doing random shit on Jesse's stream because my audio is not connected to my Xbox. I always forget this because I still remember that time when I was streaming and I had the connect on and I accidentally said Xbox off and it did. And it finished my, it closed my stream and everything. I'm a mouse. Squeak, squeak. Squeak, squeak, and squeak, squeak. No, that's a squirrel. Wait. Um, no, I'm a cat, but while well, the mice is away, the cats will play doesn't sound quite right. <laughs> Does it? <laughs> so, yes. Right. 
777717. We are back. It's okay. No one panic. No one panic. The ultimate Joe will have her. Yeah, I need 60 gamer score to get six sevens. Thank you very much, Leaky, for a shout out. I was last stream last streaming hourglass. Oh, I wonder how that was. How that how that was. Um, so, oh, actually, I'm gonna go submit those last two um last two thingies. Two more flags while I'm thinking about it. Submit a two things. Okay, deep under the pyramid. Solve four puzzles. Not storyline. Also not musical. Oh, apparently it's unmissable. I had, had it unmissable and unobtainable when it was uh, first released. But it got patched fairly quickly. Mm. Apparently it was broken on a Series X. I don't know if we haven't made everything purple how easy it would be to go back to those areas but I think we're just marking them as not storyline I'm going to rate that three and a half because of the annoying glitch of that but I wasn't I did enjoy it uh, how long did it take us uh, so it took us. Oh, also, I realised I uploaded my first the first the first vod, and I call it House Glass instead of Hourglass, which is just amusing. Okay, so two and a quarter, six and a half plus an hour, seven, seven to eight hours. Six to eight works. I've been entertaining your stream while you've been away. I behave myself. Have you been vamping over my stream? Yes. How's well, it going? Hear me. How's the vamping going? Um, I mean, I've just been entertaining. I, I didn't do anything rude. I wouldn't have thought you would have. No. I did hail the chair, though. I mean, that's, that's normal. Uh, my gamer score is now fixed. And I rated Hourglass three and a half because of the annoying fat, the jumping. Because I was enjoying the game, but then the jumping. Um, Apparently it was broken on the Series X when it first came out. Yeah, I mean... I don't know what I would give it. It took us about 8 hours, 7 to 8 hours. Yeah, that's... that's not terrible. No, not really. I think that's good. Good value for 13 quid. Um. Oh, I know what I can do. Uh. Most of more lawns. Play some death loop. Oh, Scruff is not feeling very well. Wizard in the slug. Wizard in the slug. Might as well knock out that. Um. Okay. Um. 
Cool. Was that one of the ones I picked that you had started or hadn't started? I hadn't started. Ow. Hadn't started. Well, it was in your collection. I basically went through your collection because I figured that was fair. Um, and then Game Pass, because I know you have that. So that's a like a one. And it's a zero to one half an hour. Ah, interesting. In the beginning, there was nothing but the sea of chaos. Of course, I've got like a four second delay, so that's going to be... We'll see how much this actually completes the game. Fine beans. Ooh, titans. Okay, I'm assuming you don't want random delayed Joe commentary while you're streaming. I mean, you can do whatever you please with that. Okay. Well, I do need to go make some more tea. So, I could come back if you would like some random commentary. Or, what I could do is get my Lacuna Chunky Boy achievements and then I am so close to hitting my game score goal. Never, Dan. No favoritism. Favoritism? No favoritism? I don't do favoritism. No, wait, Jesse does favoritism. Oh yeah, no, I totally did good request. Um, I have no idea what's in your queue though. Just, I have like nearly half a million unwritten walkthroughs, so... And I did Dan's. What well, Dan was one of my more recent requests done. Hmm. How many have you got in your queue? Because I just have yours. Uh, the power wash simulator. A lot. A lot. <laughs> yeah, I had a lot, and then I went right. I'm going to either clear these out or refund the points because they were making me anxious. <laughs> tea time with Joe. Okay, well, I'm gonna make tea. And I will be back. <laughs> or not. Okay. Maybe. What did I get an achievement for already? Oh, begin the game. We will try not to use the easy assist mode, apparently. Should have been an achievement. It was. We punished a bad, bad berry. Okay. Hmm. 
I'm not sure that's how legs actually work, but it's okay. Not sure how what works. Uh, reattaching limbs. Oh. Um. Okay. Apparently, yeah, we little... the wizard charm lost an arm and a leg, and we just turned them over, and they reattach them. Okay. Or the witch. She said she's a witch. The pink lady. The pink lady is apparently a witch. Cool. It's a little bit like a Powerpuff Girl. Right. I was going to go, go with, to like, uh, Homestar Runner. Yes! That's the art style. I've not really seen that, so... Ooh. Okay. Ah! The goo is shooting at you. You're freaking out the hearts! Okay, that's cute. But you have to avoid the green goo, don't you? Or do you? Are you not avoiding the green goo? I'm the one shooting the green goo. I'm the slug. What? Where's the slug? I'm the little green ball. I can't see a slug. No. Why are you shooting the the pink lady then? I was supposed to. No. Oh. I think the game is real leaking. I'm not sure. How many months am I? It's just seven months. I know. It's a long time. See, I'm, I'm, I'm the slug. Okay, you're bigger now. Yeah, because what you can do so is you can shoot or like double jump, triple jump. And you uh, lose. Oh, mass. You're basically snot balling everywhere. Yeah, pretty much. <laughs> Why did you kill the pink fluff? The pink fluff looks cute. It's mean. And then you got spiked on oh, spiky boys. I feel like it sort of serves you right. But... Apparently there's a boss rush mode. You can just do that and get all the achievements super quick. Oh. I know, okay. right? I, I feel like... You know, you're shooting all the cute things. Yeah, I'm not sure. I am so considering it myself, Leaky. I really am. Oh my god, is that the VR trombone game? It's not VR. Oh no. Okay, because I saw a VR trombone thing and it made my ears bleed. Uh, or at least it didn't seem like it was a VR thing, like it's mouse and keyboard. It may have been something else, or it may have been like also ported to the. Uh... But yeah, it was basically like, how can we possibly make everybody's ears bleed? That is, try and play a trombone in VR with no breath control, and every note is slightly wrong. Torture, torture! I tell you. You can shoot up by holding up. Down by holding down. Never knew that. But that information game. It's not like Jesse has been doing that for most of the game. <laughs> right? Yeah, basically, th th there's like eight endings to this game. And there's no way of like making saves and like replaying sections, so you have to play it through eight times. So I'm trying to do different choices without accidentally unlocking anything else. Uh oh. So I'm making bad choices. Where am I going? Talk to Psytech. Um, because all I want to get is Chunky Boy. So I the fact that it's a cool name for an achievement. 
Plot with expert timing. Do, 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 do. In fact, he's a little bit frightening. Do, 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 do. Sorry. One of the characters said fast as lightning in my game and it gave me a song. Okay. <laughs> I figured I'd subject everyone to it. Ooh. Ooh, Half-Life Alex. Yes, that's the one where everyone was fascinated with the beer bottles because the the liquid physics and the, the, the light and the refraction and the shaders were freaking awesome. Everybody was kung fu fighting. Are you insinuating something, little pink blob? Who are we? Oh, there's a black blob! Is this one of the bosses? I have no idea. But we killed it and we got a, a piece of hope! Okay, is it an arm or a leg? What, what happened circle. to this person called Hope? I was thinking oh that God. I was actually, like, you know, giving hopes and dreams, but I don't know. No, apparently you were dismembering a person called Hope and then gifting um, pieces of them. Mainly because there's a character called Hope in the book that I'm reading. So that's why I immediately went, you've got a piece of her? Oh, no. That doesn't sound good. But yes, the bottle liquid physics is entirely done in the shader. That is correct. But, like, someone did an entire article on it because, you know, shaders are hard. We're trying to do a diamond shader at the moment, and it's really hard to, fi okay. to figure out how to stimulate so... fraction and stuff. <gasps> oh, I'll be right back. Did you get someone's head? It looks like you've got someone's head there, and then you're surrounded by pink balls. Honestly, it looks like you've got Hope's head, and then you're surrounded by little pink balls. Okay, Jesse's gone again, so we can vamp. Um, so I don't know if you remember me playing Lacuna. Anyone who's here, um, I'm in charge of the stream. We should hail the chair. All hail the chair. All hail the chair. Hail the mighty chair. Now I sound like a sick owl. Um, but yeah, so I'm, I'm replaying Lacuna. Lacuna was the one where uh, we tried to kill ourselves with smoking. Uh, our daughter got kidnapped and we petted the lizard. So now I'm trying to overfeed the lizard. Um, okay. So I am investigating a weird ad. What is going on with the weird ad? Okay. So, I got all the missable chair. achievements. So, what? now we should just play and be, beat the story. Okay. What were the missable achievements? Apparently, um, punishing the berry who stole the witch's uh, leg and then <laughs> inspect the face, the weird face. Oh, that's what the head was for. Okay. Apparently. Because all I saw was you left it with a dismembered head surrounded by pink balls. No, those, they're, they're all. That's the berries. Ah. Oh. So, the berries are balls. Yes. Oh my god, right, that's gonna annoy the crap out of me. Oh yeah, this is the one where we spent ages sitting in chairs. Which one? Pretty 
hearts. What game? Lacuna. I don't think I've played that one. Probably not. It's point and click. Sometimes play point and clicks. <laughs> like, on the odds, I doubt you'd have the patience to get all eight endings on this one. <laughs> Never know. I have the patience for a lot of bullshit. No? A banana! No, no, no. Banana for scale! It's Banana Man. Okay, okay the broadcast was more, so if we put Cox, spelt with an X, we get it wrong. We're specifically getting everything wrong. So that we don't accidentally. <gasps> banana phone! Dum 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 dum. Banana phone! Dum, 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 dum. You have bananas! He's joining me on my adventure. Banana phone! By day, he was a mild man. Banana man can't jump. Oh. We lost Banana Man. Oh no. Right? That was a weird ass cartoon. Like the 90s. What? The, the, the banana. Bana banana Man. Banana Boy. Eric. His name was Eric. And he ate bananas and he turned into Banana Man! Oh. I mean, I Maybe remember bananas in pajamas. Yes, there was also bananas in pajamas, which I could also sing if you would like. No, I'm good. Thank you. <laughs> bananas in pajamas. <laughs> Come me down the stairs. Banana Man was a peculiar British anime series from. Is it from the 80s? I don't know whether it was 80s or 90s. I suppose 80s makes more sense because I was a kid when I watched it. Nineteen eighty three to eighty six. Okay, cool. Okay. I was really young, we only had repeats. But yeah, Eric. Eric was, you know, a mild mannered, you know, wimpy guy who ate bananas and turned into Banana Man who saved the day. And I'm fairly certain there was a dog. Don't ask me what the dog was called. So don't remember. British animated series. All one word. Banana man. Okay, yeah, no, that's an actual thing. Yeah. Okay. He had a pet crow! I thought he had a dog. I mean, crow makes more sense. Crow makes more sense, I suppose. Yes. Are you sure the crow was the evil? I mean, there was an evil, there was definitely an evil guy. Um, there's always an evil guy in these things, I guess. Go to cock security. Cox security. Oh no, the phone is ringing. Oh my god, is that a gherkin? What, the thing in front of me? Yeah. No, it looks to be like a slime. Okay, but it seems to be a cannibalistic slime, right? Yeah. Because it just said, I ate all my friends and now I feel great. I think I'm paraphrasing. The boss. I'm annoying myself. Don't I? <laughs> I had TikTok songs in my head earlier. Ooh, now I'm in a restaurant. Interviewing someone's wife. your husband. Ah, I am a lawyer. Not, she's not obligated to give you any information. It's okay. I will talk to the nice CDI guy. We're gonna go outside because, you know. We might have gotten another piece of hope. <gasps> Maybe. We'll see. The characters in Banana Man were voiced by members of the goodies. I don't even know who the goodies are. I'm assuming it was a band. Sounds like a band. Yeah, I have no idea. 
Uh, no arms, no problem. Literally, that's what the ad sounds. So, ad says, no arms, no problem. So, if you've got Hope's arms, then you don't have a problem. Well, Hope doesn't have a problem. Right, find Maul's apartment. Oh, we got the spread shot. Ooh. So you can stomp at people in even wider vision. Here's my cell number, random person. Who gives cell phones out numbers out to random people? Come on. I mean, to be fair, she's like the wife of a suspect, so. But this is the game which makes you go to get like it's like everything is beamed to your cell phone. Okay, where am I going now? Go to cop security. Oh no, phone's ringing. It's Gary. Oops. Dank passage! Oh it's dear. definitely dank. Dank. That, I don't think that's a word I particularly like. Dank. No? I know people have a problem with moist. I think dank is worse. Really? Yeah. Interesting. I don't have a problem with moist. Mainly because it's the name one of the names of my it's the name of one of my favourite Terry Pratchett characters. Moist von Lipwick. Lipwick. Okay. In Going Postal. Which is a really cool book. Ew! No, those are also bad. Bad! <laughs> bad Leaky. <laughs> I also don't like ooze. Because it's okay, it's a bodily thing. Ooze is not good. Ah, I'm getting shot at! Oh no, my partner's dead. I'm just gonna fire at the asshole. It's over! Shooting an agent starts an alarm, I'm gonna bluff. Oh! Stood in this time. That's a different choice. Maybe that gives me a different end. I'd be worried about doing with that. Oh, we what? died again. Back to the dank passage. Ew. Are those rubber duck seals? I don't know. I, I kind of don't always pay attention to these kinds of things and go, oh yeah, this game is supposed to make sense. It's about a wizard and a slug. I think, you know, that's uh, enough of a question of... Huh. Fishy! Fishy! Oh, hey, you've got this cute antenna and your blue one here under the water. That's adorable. Okay, so if we don't shoot him, we can inspect stuff. Destroying records. Oh no. Bad, bad guy. How dare you destroy records? All right, I can go home. I can feed my chunk. I have to enter the train. I spend a lot of time on the train because apparently my character is afraid of driving. I seem to remember. 
So we spend all our time traveling by train, uh, which is fine, except that I always have to remember which direction the train station is. Doo -doo -doo. Banana phone. It's kind of cute, this game. Oh, I'm on the train. Is there someone I can do? Oh no, I'm just gonna get a back call. It's my ex-wife. Oh no, my daughter has disappeared. I just wanna feed my lizard. What kind of euphemism is that? <laughs> it's not a euphemism. No? No, it's actually a pet lizard. Possibly an iguana. I forget what its name is, but I get to pet it. It's called Horace. It's called Horace. And I get an achievement it's called Chunky Boy. If I feed it all the time during this game. Okay, I have the option to go talk to my ex-wife because my daughter has disappeared, or I can just go home. I think I should probably go talk to her because I've been talking to her in this playthrough. And yeah, we're trying not to be a complete dick. I think I'm probably close to my radio. Yeah, I it. Yeah. Now I've got a cat buddy. <gasps> who has a made-up country cat. called their own original country that they made up called Japan. Okay. I didn't know Japan was made up. I, 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 I don't try to understand these things. Okay. Like I said, there's just uh... oh. the kitty. Can you pet the kitty? Can you pet the kitty? No. Why? Us. The kitty went in water and turned blue. I don't think kitty was too happy about water. Kitties don't like water. They're hydrophobic. Some kitties like water. In the book I'm reading, that has a character called Hope. There is a, a person that turns in. Oh, different book I'm reading. There's one book I'm reading that has a character called Hope. And then the other book I'm reading has um, a person, a cat that turns into a person. It was originally a person, they got cursed. But they got. They were a water nymph, and then they got cursed to be turned into a cat because cats don't like water. That was the logic of the person doing the cursing person doing the cursing was Poseidon. Yes, Leaky, thank you for the host, by the way. <laughs> oh my god. Yeah, when it comes to these weird posted games, I'm just kind of like, okay. Da, 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 da. It was cheap and, you know. Yeah. It's a platformer. It's a shooty shooty very basic platformer, but... Yeah. You get to play as a lump of green slime and you have a cat. We will not go in the water. See? I told you they were hydrophobic. Yep, and we're gonna lose our cat buddy now. Oh, bye-bye cat buddy. Cat buddy is purple as well. Okay, someone broke into my apartment. Oh no, but can I feed Horace? Don't worry, it's just a hacker slash terrorist slash person that killed people. Assassin, that's the word I wanted. It's okay. They've just got your daughter to force you to do things. What do you want? Okay, we have your daughter. We have your daughter. Uh, what did you do to her? She's fine. Who is we? We 
want the data. Oh, yeah, we're completely underwater for the next bit. Oh, no. I can see why we lost our cat. Oh, darn. Underwater passage. We were dank, Under now we're underwater. <laughs> I feel like... I don't know. How do things become games? Who comes up with these ideas? Creative people come up with creative ideas. Uh, you got you safe or you you just off into the spikes there? Well technically as long as you don't take damage while you're small, you're okay. Cool. That's the only way you actually get hurt, apparently. But yeah, Dan, I guess the question is, which request of yours should I work on? Because oh, yeah. one of them is, like, pure pain. It gets to feed my chunky boy. Damn it. Stupid terrorist. Because completing Super Bomberman R is not exactly a, uh, what I would call a great streamable game. <laughs> you mean, maybe you should do, what was it, Dragon Ball Z? No, the, um, dra the one that Ruff requested. Uh, Blood Dragon? Trials of the Blood Dragon? Oh god, because fuck me. <laughs> <laughs> No arms, no problem. Be right back. We're not joining this group, I don't know. <laughs> no, we didn't have a choice, we are joining, okay. It's the Banana Man! Find your banana. F Why is your banana friend? What, Join what the doing? rebel group here. It looks like it looked like he was humping something. But he was—he's think... the official cook. Ah. And you have a My Little Pony with a pirate My Little Pony. I was gonna go with another cat. Oh, it's the cat. I think it's a different cat. 
Oh, okay. It looks like the same cat. Yeah, I'm not sure. And dust mice. They're little spiders. And then you've got step two, backstab. Step three, topple regime. But I can't see what step one is, so... Thus, I am not going to be able to do anything about it. The Mighty Dustmite Gang, okay. Or Extraordinary Freedom Ooh, Fighters. Dustmite. with Dustmites. The Mighty Dustmite Gang. Okay. You were right. Step one, dustmite. find record recruits. Ah, cool. Ta -da. Slime Volleyball, oh yeah. I remember that game as a kid. Cool. Slime Volleyball. Or just Volleyball. Slime Volleyball. You played Slime Volleyball. Yeah, that was like a computer game that was Slime Volleyball. I'm gonna go with not when I was a kid. I mean, it was like high school. We had Swiv. I remember Swiv, but I was not a kid. Kid. Um, I, I, I've never heard of slime volleyball. I wait for Leaky to go. Oh, slime volleyball was a game I had scored between like 2003 or something, and I'm like, I was at university. <laughs> Hi, Lady McGreet. I'm confusing you because it is Joe's voice on Jesse's stream. Jesse is currently trying to play slime volleyball with a ball of wool, which totally would unravel realistically. Only a cat would play slime volleyball with a ball of wool. What are we gonna do? Talk to the chief, talk to Gary. Well, screw the chief. We just quit for no reason. We can find Gary. <laughs> Joe was live earlier. We finished Hourglass. And now I'm playing Lacuna. And um, randomly commentating on Jesse's stream because he let me. That's his first mistake. <laughs> I've let worse people on my stream. Fair enough. Where is Gary? It doesn't say go to the train, let's just talk to Gary. Where the bleep is Gary? Like Alice all over again. Maybe he's in our office. Yes, he's up there. I can just randomly hear yoink, yoink, yoink. I'm sure Lady McGreet's got this game done. Of course. Lady McGreet's got it going on! Um. Talk to the chief, look at the pin board. I got my uniform. Oh my god, that really looks terrible. Oh, um, what? Huh? Is that a mouse head? <laughs> Maybe. <coughs> oh boy. arrested someone so therefore we can talk to him because last time he ran away the first time he ran away the second time i just shot him because i'm like screw you now we can talk to him apparently wherever he is he's in here oh my god good afternoon mr cox 
I'd like to ask you a few questions. I'm waiting for my legal team. Hmm. You shot my partner. Care to explain? You didn't make the best first impression. <laughs> You're narrating your game on my stream. Just a little bit. Just a little. Okay, I really just, like, completely fluffed that up, but I kind of fluffed it up on purpose. I'm trying to be really inept. Submit the sheet. Moore's motive was clearly his nationalism, not his sick wife. Right, now we're Underwater to passage. Gary. You were? I guess it's better than the dank passage. Yeah, as long as it's not like a... A moist passage. <laughs> Multitasking. Oh, yeah. Enter the train! Seriously, we spend our entire life on this damn train. I feel like we should have some sort of train sponsorship. Bing! Can we go back and pet our chunky boy? Feed our chunky boy. Now we gotta wait for the train. Whoa! That is a gigantic crab. Right? Such a very disturbing mouse. Mouse. <laughs> well, Jesse doesn't talk. So, you know. I'm just gonna be the little voice in his ear. Oh no, we've gone to the market. Anyone want a banana? Possibly some chips? Frat burger? Does the wizard oh. not know it's a crab? No, the, the wizard's not exactly the brightest. Oh. But also doesn't understand time because said we've been friends for months or minutes or some measure of time. I mean, that sounds about right. Maybe the wizard has ADHD. No concept of time. Can't remember the names to save their lives. Sounds reasonable. Oh, the crab has ADHD. Okay, fair enough. Maybe everyone's got ADHD. Question the wife. Hello, Mrs. Moore. Oh, it's you again. I need to ask you more questions. Are you after my husband? I told you he's on vacation. He is not on vacation. Chat. Never left. Dun dun dun. I think he's going to blow something. And now we need to enter the train again. God, seriously, like, a third of this game is literally, get on train, go somewhere, get on train, go somewhere, occasionally go home, get on the train again. Oops. There we go. Let's go have a beer with the terrorist. Just to appease her so she doesn't kill my daughter. Have a bear. We killed the crab! Yay! I don't know if it was a good thing, but we did it. Imagine having to be on trains the whole time. Oh boy. Ah, uh, I, I work from home. So thankfully I don't have trains anymore. Oh no, I have to enter the train again. I had a beer with the bad guy. The bad girl. And now I'm going to get another train. Oh no, my phone is ringing. It's Gary! God damn it, Gary. Train. 
Try living forever. That, that's a hassle. Right? Anyway, some fights are worth having. A world devoid of any conflict is not worth living in. Or something, something, something. Yeah, I'm not trying to take the story too seriously. <laughs> How? It doesn't make sense. How can you understand anything at all? I mean, unless your name is... I've forgotten the character's name. Um, I'll say I've literally forgotten the character's name. Which? I know his boss is Gary. Oh. Uh, and his wife is called Kat. His name is not Patrick, though. That would make more sense. If his name is Patrick, because his wife was Kat. Maybe she'll say his name and then I'll be like, Neil! His name is Neil. Oh, that's not confusing at all. Maybe we're going to reconciliate. No, I'm not going to hug her. That would be weird. Our daughter is missing. I'm going to go home. And if you let me feed the chunky boy, we might have this achievement. Are you going to let me feed the chunky boy? Maybe not, because I've not finished his chapter yet. But can I go home without there being a... Oh no, the phone is ringing! Yeah, you're not God getting this achievement, so we're going to let you do it. <laughs> no, no, it's letting me go home. Then there's going to be another crisis okay. preventing you from feeding. Oh. Chunky boy. How do you get a random Joe commentary when you stream? Um... Do you, you let me know when you're going to stream, and I will get on a Discord chat. I'm happy to do random commentaries. Apparently that's the thing I do now. I, I did it for the Big Bad Gaming thing, for, for Fuzzy. Um, but I mean, you know, it, it just so happened that, you know, because Jesse and I were co-streaming, then, you know, it sort of... I was like, well, I'll stay on if Jesse doesn't mind. Jesse doesn't seem to mind. Oh no! God damn it, Zora! I want to feed my bloody lizards! <laughs> <sighs> She's threatening me. It's like, you need the data. It's like, yes, but I'm being dense on this playthrough. Oh no, you're going to ask me to betray my friends. <sighs> I'm just going to say okay, because I just want to feed my lizard. But I'm not betraying him on this one because I betrayed him last time and it made me feel bad, but also I've already done that ending, so. Go to sleep. No! Hey Horace, how's it going? Feed Horace. Horace went bloop. Maybe that's not enough. Go to sleep. I got it! I got it! I got it! Chunky boy! Okay. Now I'm hoping that my maths is good. Chunky boy, 35G. I now have 25G left, which is my stable achievement. But I'm going to do that tomorrow because, yeah. And then I might do another random to-do list one so I have 10. Because I totally abandoned that. Last save, 37 seconds ago. 39 seconds ago. Cool. Well, we'll go back. Okay, use Gary's login. Mostly agreed with Sora. I have 
world where I'm up to. Boopity boopity boop. We're climbing a mountain. Cool, now I can pay full attention to um, the Jesse game. Think that We've is only got it. about half the achievements so far. Yeah, that's, that's good. We could have gone with the quick way to do this bird mountain. Yeah, but that wouldn't be any fun then, would it? Apparently there's a boss rush mode available. Yes, I did see that when you started. Or well, like arcade or something. Well, the arcade, I think, just gets rid of the story bits. Why would you want to get rid of the story bits? Then? Oh, I don't okay. know. I now have 777752, which then my spreadsheet, because I did the spreadsheet, because I didn't trust my maths. My spreadsheet says I have 25G left. Get me to 777. Very cool spreadsheet. That was interesting. I think I lost a little bit of track of what the story was actually doing, though. What was there to lose track of? Like, I kind of forgot that we were in Egypt. <laughs> and at the end, it was very much, uh, there was very little payoff for opening that door. It was like, oh, we're floating in the clouds. Um, okay. Is yeah. this, like... Well, did we die? It's a metaphor. Okay. But what is it metaphor? I don't know. Is it the metaverse? Yeah, that probably doesn't... Does, does normal people know what the metaverse is? is I mean, I think I've heard that? it. It's just, you know... Okay, cool. Not totally obscure then. Good, good, good. But I don't think I've ever it's heard good. it with a good context. No, no. I'm not going to say it's a good thing. Um, this, this, this game, Lacuna, has Enter the Multiverse, which I think is better than the Metaverse. I was really annoyed when that Shift Quantum achievement was like, this is not possible anymore because I am bad at the game. A really good YouTube video. The person that's like been through all the you know, levels with the. It's like, I'm only redoing the ones I got stuck on and didn't get the thing. But of course, the reason I got stuck on one of them was because I can't do that jump. Yeah, I don't remember. I think I've got that game done. Shift Quantum. It's the one with the weird blocks and the girl with the yellow scarf. It's just pure puzzle with platformy stuff, but it wasn't massively platformy until this particular achievement, where you have to get all the glitches complete to 100%. And I am just not able. Yeah, I think I got that one done then. Probably. I should have a look. TA will tell me. She... One them. Friends playing. Compare with friends. Radical sniper. Yes, you did. Completed the game. Oh, good. In seven and a half hours. Really? You spent three hundred eighty minutes. You spent three hundred eighty minutes looking for happiness. Uh, that's all. You're like still looking for that one. <laughs> that's what the game says. Yes, you completed it back in June 2018. So, yeah. It's just a particularly tricky level, and I should do all the other ones so that all I've got left is that one. But considering I'm now not doing it for my thing, um, there's no rush. Draw. 
is playing Nino no Kuni, which I really want to play. So I've got my, my gamer score poll. I am going to have a look at that one. Yeah, it's on the list. Yeah. I need to get better at playing the Game Pass games that I want to play and finishing the Game Pass games that I want to play. So they don't, so I don't, it doesn't get to like the last half a month and I'm like, shit, I wanted to play that. And Nino Kuni is going to be a lot more than a half a month. Well, exactly. If I want to enjoy it properly. But I've got it installed. There's also the Dangan Rumpers. I need to finish the first one. So and now three of them it. are there. I know! I haven't even played the second one, and the third one's already out. God damn it. I'll be right back again. I want to play Tinykin as well. That looks cute. I wish that was multiplayer. And I could play Tinykin with Jesse, and he could, like, carry me through some of the levels. You know, because that's where I game with Jesse. <laughs> There's a penguin! Oh. Penguin. Oh, yeah, so it doesn't the microphone doesn't have the peaking thing because I'm on Jesse's OBS. I wonder if I can pick the peak the mic on Jesse's stream. <laughs> no, I wouldn't do that. It's a penguin! 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 Also, all hail the chair! Hail the mighty chair! Hail, hail chair! Oh, I peeked earlier. Oh, I'm sorry. Was that when I was squeaking? I squeaked. Or did I get very excited? Either is possible. Aha! I am an influencer! I make everyone make tea! Though that message was an hour ago. Uh, <laughs> I got my Chunky Boy achievement! Yay! And I'm possibly getting COVID booster on Friday, which would be cool. Because, you know, Jesse's stream needs to know this about me. Um, what else? Um... I'm reading a cool book series where book characters come to life. One of them owns a bookstore, which I think is fairly meta. And I get paid on Friday. Yay! I suppose I should advertise um, September, even if it is for Jesse. Um, September is 25% off your sub and also counts for gift subs. Both Jesse and I are doing uh, contribute to Extra Life. Jesse's back. It's fine. I'm promoting your stream. It's okay. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> and there's penguins. Penguins. So yeah, both Jesse and I are doing donation matching donations to Extra Life, which means that your sub is worth three times as much as the donation to to Extra Life this month. I believe that's right because you know. Which take half, so we're contributing the same, then that makes it like three times as, as good. But for this month only, and there is like two days. Penguins don't month. like me. What did you do? Why are the penguins angry? Did you steal their cheese? Apparently, I was peeping. <gasps> You're a peeping, peeping slime. Apparently? Is your name Tom? I don't think so. Is that a hairdryer or an unknown? Or possibly. Oh, it's a little birdie. Yeah. It's Bird Mountain. It so. looks like. Ah, it looks. Banana like Man! An unknown. Hmm? Banana! Bananas in pajamas. Come in your western. No. Ring, 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 ring. Banana for oh, there's a pair of boots. Yes, that's what I was trying to say, Leaky. They're all, they're, they're, they're both useless. Words. The boots. Yeah, the because. Thanks, Leaky. <laughs> uh. It's funny we uh. 
I did it for May with the birth month thing. Mm. And then I did it last year as well. So. I forgot to do it last year. Probably because it tried to make the dollar sign into a variable, Yuki. Um, I forgot to do it last year because I thought it was a good idea, but I wasn't prepared. I was going to do it, like, in, like, Mental Health Awareness Month, and then my mental health was bad. Um, and then this year, mostly, I got a lot of interest at the very, very beginning of the month, and then everyone's already, you know, subbed, so... <laughs> I'll try again tomorrow, but it's fine. I got a decent amount to do a decent donation. Um, but yeah, you killed it with your birthday. Um... Yeah, this month was not as successful, so it happens. You probably end up with more than mine, possibly. No. In the end. Right. No, I don't think so. You just have more people watching usually consistently for the Zelda stuff, so... Burp. Save point... A cactus. Pickle. Oh, okay. It is water. The cactus. Is it a for drinking water? Yes, uh, but apparently if the cactus drinks too much, they say he has a drinking problem. Hmm. I am frustrated. I just want to punch someone in the face. I like pineapple. I like pineapple. Yuck. Oh. We can't be friends now, Jesse. <laughs> no. Pineapple and pizza is yummy. No. It is. No. It is. I just can't eat it anymore because it makes me ill. Oh dear god, what's that thing done now? Oh, another thing? Uh, Auto Dusk is now integrated into Epic Games, Epic Unreal. Wait, what? Auto Dusk, as in the CAD software? Yeah. Just 3D objects. Makes sense. Wait, why for neither of us? If one of us likes pineapple on pizza and the other one doesn't, I would think one of person would get pineapple or pina colada. Because it's got coconut in, and I don't like coconut. Oh. Pina colada is pineapple and coconut, right? I like pineapple, I just don't want it on my pizza. What with the, with the ham? It's just the salty sweets. No, it doesn't work on pizza, really? in my opinion. I've I tried. Just, I just like that combination of flavor. I understand. Not, not people. Some people don't like it. Pickle friend! I know it's a cactus, but it looks like a giant pickle. I don't like pickles, I have to say. Wow, we really can't be witchy. friends. <laughs> yeah, I've got one more day of streaming for September, so. Yeah, I've got tomorrow. You've got Friday? Or you do? Yeah, because you've got yeah. me tomorrow. Whip chops. <laughs> oh dear. Okay, so that's a thing. What? Sorry. Checking my work email on one of the clients. It's like, oh yes, we'd like people to attend an in-person thing in Austria in October. And I'm thinking, I'm sure there'll be people that want to go to that. I don't, but I'm sure there will be. Go to what now again? Austria. Huh. I have nothing against Austria. I just don't want to travel. 
Also, thankfully, my friend is going to be over then, so I can't. I have prior obligations. Oh, no. But yes, oh, yeah, um, so next Tuesday, the 4th, my friend is over, so I cannot stream. Dude, that's another, another Joe off on Tuesday. What is the world coming to? I know, right? It's weird. I've got, like, Tuesday and Wednesday. I've got half, half a Tuesday and a Wednesday off. Work. In the, right, right in the middle of the week. It's weird. But, you know, Daisy's over, so why not? Um, sure. So I'm just letting you know. Okay. But the Tuesday after, I should be good to go. And then at the end of this month, the time does its time thing. So... Oh, is that this weekend for you guys? Way. No, at the end of the month. Okay. Uh, sorry, the end of next month. I realise we're not at the end of September yet. Uh, yeah, so it is the day before Halloween. It changes. I don't know when it changes for you, though. We're usually off by a week. Yeah, I was going to say. Mickey! Seriously? <sighs> You know, I can't blame you, Leaky. I just, I don't get this whole... People calling people daddy and having it be sexy. Some people have weird kinks. I don't know. But, 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 but parents are not sexy. Your, your parents are not, not, you know, my <laughs> parents. That's just weird. I mean... You could say somebody else's parents are sexy, I guess, but you wouldn't say that about your own parents. Exactly. So why <laughs> would you call someone daddy? It's the, it's the one thing I don't get. Okay, there's many things I don't get. But that one particularly, it's a whole Oedipal thing. But it's like flipped on its head. Freud or something. Oh god! Hang on. 30 10 and it, you did that day backwards on purpose. Um, so your daylight saving doesn't change until after extra life. Apparently. That's gonna be useful though, because that means we'll be closer together. Whether that's useful or not, I don't know. I know technically they're both correctly formatted, but it threw me. I'm like, it doesn't change until June? Because <laughs> I first read it, I saw the 11 and went, there's two weeks difference? Because I thought it was the 11th of November. Um, but yeah, have we got any, like, proper co-stream things? Like, proper co-play games? I don't know. I mean, we mm. can finish off... Blue mode, but that's not. But in terms <laughs> of something for. I was thinking something fun for Extra Life. Yeah. Uh, it might be the new Escape Academy DLC. I think that was Juice Roundabout then, right? Ish, possibly. Are you fighting a dragon or a big ass bird? I think a big ass bird. Well, if you stop stomping on its eggs, maybe it won't be angry at you. It was angry at me before. I mean, you are shooting its babies and stomping on its eggs, so... I can't Where is your health bar? It's that heart. Ah, but it doesn't be going down. Oh god, now the penguins are in on it! And you made one pink. There's buzzards and a bloody big phoenix bird and penguins. Come on, you've nearly got it. Woo! The DLC is called Escape from the Anti-Escape Island. Does it say when it comes out, Leaky? All I said was like... Soon, TM. I think I posted something in my Discord and of course promptly forgot. Let me have a look. Games. Soon. Right. Fall. Technically it's fall. Will it be out by the 5th of November is the question. 
because that would be good. We could do that because that's proper co-op. Like when we did the, uh, the, that secret agent one, that was really cool. Less fun with the labyrinth in the We Were Here, one of the We Were Here's, because, you know. Yeah, I mean, we right. can, you yeah. know, that'd be something. Yeah. Maybe you're just a what? Sorry, I'm not even reading these <laughs> ramblings. Tomboy! Tomboy is what it said. You seem confused. Are you sure you're a girl? <laughs> This story is weird. Yep, that's that I kind of uh <laughs> Haven't been paying as much attention. Uh oh. I'm gonna. It's gonna be an auto scroll run from the lava, isn't it? I mean, what is a game without an auto scroll run from the lava? Right. I mean, if there are chainsaws, um, and or you know, a big fire breathing dragon, that also will make it really exciting. There'll be obstacles, you know. And occasional rest points. I do put a safe swirl there. Do you have a passion? Look, kid, let me show you something. Oh, I got, I, I can move. Okay. Game saved. Act oh. two, the reason. Oh. The reason why? 42! 42! Oh. down there. Is that a flower? The little flamies. They're immortals. We don't see them on the surface anymore. I don't know why that is. They're cowards, that's why. But it's not their fault. They can't help it. They're not like you and me, kid. Who is she calling kid? Yeah, I'm trying to determine the age of our uh, our slime slug buddy here. The slime? Oh, like seven million? A time when mortals and immortals were a lot more alike. But it was not in a good way. I got in a lot of trouble trying to change that and I had to give up a, a lot. I had to give up even who I was as a person. It used to be pretty powerful a long time ago. I broke your chains, the chains of you mortals. But they down there, they still wear their chains. Freedom is my passion, kid. It was always my dream. Now to make you, not to make you different from them, something, something. Understand, unlike them, you're already free if you wanted. You could turn around and leave. You could forget about me, about the immortals. And I would not be able to stop you. It's a beautiful thing. Of course, you could try and change your mind. Be it through temptation, intimidation, mockery, but I could never truly force you. So, I'd rather just ask. It's not going to get easier from here, and I need a partner, not a hostage, not a slave, not a coward. I know they're different from you, but I'm asking you to please consider their fate. As it now lies in our hands. It's understood, kid? The choice is yours. If you leave now, I'll understand, but you know, I like having you around, so what do you say? Keep going, kid. I just thank you. I know we can do this, kid. Let's go! Woo! Inside us? Yeah. Oh, that's just weird. The whole time. This That has been the case. Okay, no! Now we get the lover. <gasps> do we get a lover friend? Oops. Volcano! Ooh! Do we get a lover friend? <laughs> Yay! We'll see. You didn't die this time. <laughs> I figured I'd restart because you restarted. <gasps> Not a flop. Oh. Not a buddy. No friends. No friends. No friends. The blob makes fire. I want lava friend. 
Okay. That was interesting. The uh, boxy thing on this is interesting. What? What am, what am I saying? The clicking boxes. The things that define the edge are very, very good because you slipped over that. I feel like if the clipping had been bad, then it would have been like, you're dead. How did you need to go up and not down? Then. Oh. I just went and hoped that it was good. Okay. This is reminding me a little bit of Ori. Or Ori. They're immortal. You shouldn't be able to kill them. I can't. Ah, you can't. But they crystallize for a moment. That is clever. I like that. It's true to the story, that. Point. Ooh, there's a little... What does the sign say? I can't read it from here. Does it say, don't go in the lava? No, I think I'd have to be able to touch it for... And you can't touch it because you can't go in the lava. Oh, it's very, very tiny. It's basically no, just no. Morse code there. Yeah, I no. think it says, SOS! Help! I'm stuck in the lava! That's what it says. No, the whole thing is like, the signs you have to get up close to read. Yeah. No, but I'm, I'm, I'm making a joke. It's, it's like if you get fridge magnets, and then you, you put a thing on it that says, Help! I'm stuck in the fridge. It's funny. Haha. <laughs> Funny, haha, not funny. I bet you're really regretting saying, yeah, sure, Joe, you can stay on and do the word commentary. No, <laughs> you have not been around for some of the bullshit. Well, have you seen you my know, team? I mean, I've heard your team. I don't think I've ever actually seen them. That wasn't me being sarcastic, that's just me being literal. Um. <laughs> But I seem so to remember that, you know, Leo and I said we were going to commentate one of your, your, your matches at some point. <laughs> and being as that I had well, been watching Well, and she streams you, with a cam, so you could see her. Introducing. Lava. The Banana Lava Man Big Band. <gasps> the Banana Man Big Band. Ooh. And the wig. The hair. But why is there a tortoise? Well, because they're part of the crowd. Ah, oh, okay. Um, but yes, considering I have watched you for like, what are we, three years nearly now playing Zelda? Right. I really don't think that I could commentate like with any degree of accuracy. I could, I mean, I could definitely commentate. Um, they're about probably three locations I would recognize. Like, the blue ball bit, and like, you know, Ganon's Tower. And then I always seem to see you doing this one bit with like, passages and the water, and like, glitching through a switch. But I don't even know what that location is. I just do not retain the names of the things. But I could probably make them up, and then that would be even funnier. Unfortunately, League's a little bit serious. Hmm? League's a bit serious. Oh, I'm not talking about League. I, oh, okay. I fairly said we were talking about commentating, like, one of your random seeds or something. I don't think we're actually talking about doing a proper commentating. I wouldn't do that, because I'm not taking it seriously. <laughs> Did you just get a Cheeto as a friend? I think so. A police cheeto. Who just said, trust me, I'm a professional. A professional what? Fire triangle? But you're, you're, you are you don't have enough bip to bip across. You're now, you're now roasted slime. Do you need to bounce off your, your fire guy? You can't bounce off your fire guy. 
How are we supposed to get across? Uh... I can only half see what Leaky wrote. He said, but it's no bod and the amazing something band. Animal band. Animal band. Okay. Who's bod? Oh. Neither do I. But, you know, we've already established. Whoa! Well, that's the thing. How did you do that? I have to wait. And then he fills me up with helium. Ah, well, that's clever. Dan is back from dog walk and is very soggy. And then Milo gets a treat. I mean, that seems legit. I mean, you should also give yourself a treat. Um, and make sure you change out of your wet clothes. But yes, I went out for um, to get a baguette um, yesterday. And it was not raining very hard when I left my flat. Because I was like, it's fine. Raining very hard. As soon as I left my flat, the skies opened and it deluged on me. Oh no, you actually lost half a heart. I think that's the first time that's happened. <laughs> so he's basically just blowing you. Yes. Cool. I mean, are you not feeling treated by my delightful commentary, Dan? <gasps> Ooh, toasted jam. Yes. I had another jam and peanut butter thing. It's growing on me. <laughs> um, I can't see you, you know. I'm just suggesting that maybe, you know, you don't sit around in wet clothes and get, like, ill. Oh, so the hearts, if you bounce on them, you get extra yeah. goob back. Well, that makes sense. I'm sweating bollocks. I need to take a little break. I went near my daily quotient. Let me just get you through this final bit. Let me just blow you this one last time, mate. <laughs> Sorry. <laughs> I don't know why I'm apologising. You know. Nothing to apologise for. No, not it. Uh, excuse me? It's like he goes... Whoop! Mm. Uh, just weird physics moment. Uh, fair enough. Whee! I mean, Dan, I won't judge who you do or do don't strip for. It's okay, you know. Mm. <gasps> it's a dragon! Uh, I think that's the same boss phoenix. that we... It's a phoenix. It's a phoenix! Okay. Same death. It's mythical! Um... Okay. Well, at least she's helping you. What is the laser beam that she does? Is that a shield? I think so. Okay. That makes sense. Because I just get confused and you've got two laser beams coming at you and it's the red one. It's the, the birdie is going to go padroing on you. But the purple one seems to be some kind of shield, which is great. But if you're just avoiding lasers, then 
<laughs> it's kind of disconcerting. Sorry, that slide back to birdie. Bad birdie. Yeah, definitely a shield. If you lose it, then she gives it back. Which is good, because it basically gives you another life. Well, the show is very lucky then, Dan. Do you have a favourite song? Oh no! Oh no! Oh no! Oh, it's okay. It's fine. It's fine. You didn't get good oil. Um, what is the glowy black-red thing? Uh, I'm not sure. It's dead anyway. I'm dead. Killed me. But I'm a phoenix, so I will rise from the ashes. I will be avenged. Some people don't take no for an answer. <laughs> it's just a little joke. Come on, it's actually a running joke at this point. Don't take it seriously. Except when I'm being serious. <laughs> Gina G! Oh my god, that's Fireball. like... You get a fire Oh, you got a fireball! Set you on ah, Won't work underwater. Fire! Yeah, there we go. With a little emoji going. You're now orange! Ooh, what is that? Is that fiery junk? Can you be friends with it? Uh, it looks like it was one of the bird enemies from that boss fight. It's badly burnt. Yeah. I should probably ask this misery. At this point, it's more cruel to keep it alive, don't you think? Pretty messed up, but it's not our fault we run into fights we don't want in a fight. I don't bother you too much. You know, mortals die every day. That's just life. You have a good heart, kid. But... You know, sometimes there are perks to being heartless, like me. Look, why don't you go on ahead? I'll deal with this. I don't think you can kill it, Jesse. You know, I can't be heartless? No. Because you have a heart, and it's Lalo. Let's just get this over with. That looks violent! Maybe it can't die. Oh, jeez. Sigh, what a waste of magic. <gasps> Did we rescue the birdie? I have no idea! Well, either that or we cook chicken. Just this. It must be a blessing from mother. I thought we couldn't have children. <laughs> I know you stopped, but I kept on praying. It's it's a girl. No. No. It's a miracle. I thought he was gonna say that. <laughs> But I'm on like a two second delay, so you know. Oh my god. Oh, miracle. Oh. <laughs> oh boy. Oh boy. Look, every day, uh, I mean, every time the sun passes over us, I'll draw a line, okay? This is called a tally mark. Count them, all right? That's how you'll know. Sun? There's no sun here, kid. Look closely. You can see some light from up here, even on cloudy days. Nah. Well, what do you know? 
And if I'm not here, you have to draw them, understand? Can you do that? Still don't see the point, kid. It's important to me! All right, all right, jeez. Scratch, scratch, scratch. Hmm. What are you doing up there now? What's that? Scratch, 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 scratch. Are you mad at me? Quiet. I'll, I'll count the time or whatever, all right? You're being mad. I'm not mad. You're just paranoid sometimes. Definitely mad. Scratch, 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 scratch. You sure like to doodle, don't you? What's that? Show me your what? Hey. It's a little heart. See? And inside. <gasps> yeah. One for you and one for me. Oh. I don't even know who's talking at this point. I figured it's the slime and the, the witch. Wizard. The no, wizard. I think this... The wizard witch is actually... Talking about... Talking to somebody different. Okay. Fair enough. Okay. I'll be right back. Okay, so in terms of achievements, we got four left. Defeat Comets, defeat Cat King, defeat Elo and also Pete, and then defeat Root. green that wasn't us apparently that was somebody named oh. truth oh so is that hope then or is that hope truth and someone else hope truth and the wizard i don't, I don't know. know was that my twin well kind of well they're more than just the two of us versus me and strange and truth who you saw now and there's also up, down, and finally beauty. Six in total. Six pluses, I guess. So we must be hope then. Time since I've seen the others though. Well, it's up strange, since we're both locked up together in the same place. I did tell you about strange, right? I didn't. Are you sure you didn't just forget? I mean, we are on a mission to bust strange out of prison, remember? No, I'm not calling you a liar. It just seems odd that you come all this way without asking why or what's the plan or where I'm going. You must really not have a lot of things to going on back home to blindly follow some old wizard halfway across the land, huh? <laughs> oh, That's come on, not I'm wrong. joking. Just busting your balls, all right? <laughs> you, you do have balls, right? <laughs> yeah, I've seen them all over the place. What am I saying? Of course you do. I've seen you constantly throwing them <laughs> haven't I? So many balls. So many balls. Is there a puff loop over there? Well, now you know the deal. We're rescuing my better half. Still in, aren't you? Are you a criminal? <laughs> right, now let's go. Hopefully we'll catch up with truth again. So then why, why are we possessing a wizard? And if you've got a piece of hope, does that mean we're hope? But they didn't mention hope. <laughs> Crystal mine. <laughs> Kitty! Oh. Hey there, stranger. Have you heard? The kingdom is moving here from the surface. We're at war, buddy. These dogs are going to pay for their unwanted affection. That's why we're here, securing the crystal mines. Crystals make good weapons, good armor, yeah? The king has already moved the castle, but it'll take a while until the capital is settled. We tried moving an entire city, it ain't easy, buddy. You're not a dog spy, are you? Or some kind of rebel scum? Uh oh, I'm actually rebel there. scum. If there was another break, I might just have to cut you down right here! Ha ha ha! So you're gonna attack the other kitties? 
Right? Don't, don't, don't hurt the kitties. Don't, don't, don't hurt the kitties. I realize they're trying to hurt you. Um. But, 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 but. You have fire! They don't like fire. Do you have water as well? Because oh. I feel like throwing water at kitties would be more effective. Oh, you apparently the fire is better. Excellent. Okay. Yes, Dan. You have rebel scum. Jesse admitted it. That one's got a tiny little shield. A little kitty with a little shield. You are doing surprisingly well not killing too many. I'm impressed. Oh no, that one fell on the spikes. <gasps> oh my god, there's big fat blue bumblebees. It's a, it's a blumble, blumblebee. Or maybe it's just really depressed. And blue, da ba dee da ba dee da ba dee Hey kid, I've been kind of trying something out. And I'd like your honest opinion. Okay, Freddy? So what do you think about this mouth? Good? Bad? What do you think? Does it suit my face? Um, maybe try another one? What, this one! Um, oh, what about this one? <laughs> what about this one? Oh, that one is perfect! This perfect! It's perfect! It's a new Wu mouth! Alright, I'll keep that one then. Thanks, kid. I trust your opinion 100%. Yes, just randomly stopped me in the middle of a spike cave to ask me if my map is good. The one you just gave yourself. That's exactly the time for that kind of stuff. Yep. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Well, I suppose it's better than, you know, randomly going me. Too soon. Yeah, it's not too soon. The orange triangle wasn't dead, so it's all good. Oh my god. Look at you just saved. But your spikes. Where's the pro tip? Avoid the spikes. Why is the kitty attacking the bees? Who's on whose side? Oops. Oh, not oops. This is a very forgiving game. Yeah. Unlike the jumping in Hourglass. I swear I had to restart that, like, under the sea puzzle. Under the sea? Under the underground puzzle, like, so many times just because I missed that sodding jump. Which was why I started the recording before I did the jump, because I figured if the clone falls in, it's okay, right? <laughs> it's a bird with the watering can? They don't <gasps> seem to be friends. Oh. Charm. Charm! Oh, is that my name? So who's Hope? And why is it- why are they in pieces? You, come back here! Kalinso? Can't read that. Font's too bloody tiny. Celano. Celiano. I think that's what it says. Mini boss. Are you getting any poppy bleep bloops today? No. no. If you restart, then it should fix it. But obviously, you know, you're midstream. But when you, if you restart after you're finished, then it should be good. All right, that's enough of that. Don't touch me. Quit moving around, kid. I'm trying to help. I don't need you. Well, it sure seems like you got smacked around by my little buddy on accident. Fing, your girlfriend? I don't think so. We're, um, just, just friends. I hate you! Hmm, well, we'll work on that later. They kept the mouth, <laughs> by the way. Yeah, for now, just stay still and let me fix you up. They did keep the mouth. I love it. It's a new room mouth. Pa. That wasn't an achievement. Well, you didn't defeat him. That's not fair. I tried. Um. 
You okay? No. Well, you seem fine. Well, I'm not. That thing just looks stupid on you. Smile. What, the mouth? Well, a friend picked it out for me. <laughs> Don't care. Get rid of it. Hmm, <clears throat> maybe you'd prefer a different one. <laughs> oh god, that's creepy. What about this one? Is this better? Or worse? It looked like a psychopath! <laughs> the freaking dang and romper TV. No, stop making me laugh! <laughs> now take it off, I don't like it. Sure, have you considered all the features? Whoa! Kissy, kissy! This is so awkward. Look, I'm no expert in mortal affection, all right? Come be some psych kid. Oh my god, they've got the creepy psychopath smile. Just take it off, please. It's creeping me out. All right, fine. You're lost, kid. The Uhu one. So, doing all the way over here. Do you see them? The flowers? Yeah, I was surprised. I've never seen any of them here before. She says I shouldn't bother. She says the soil is dead. I'm trying to breed some strains that don't need a lot of sunlight. Well, look at you. So you're like a mad scientist gardener now, or what? You need to be a priest, actually. Ha! <laughs> Good one, kid. I'm serious. Gotta be kidding me. What? You think they still let me in the guard like nothing happened? Unbelievable. Besides, when you left, I was so angry. Maybe I became a priest just to spite you. <laughs> well, it's working. I'm not happy with this. Good. Anyway, Mum thought it would be good for me. She thought perhaps it'd make me find some peace. But it just took you showing up for me to break every oath I took as a priest. Maybe I really am broken, just like you. You're broken, kid? Why don't you take me with you? It would ruin your life being on the run with me, kid. Worse than leaving me in of those I betrayed? They seen was treason. What if they got me executed? Would you even care? Don't be ridiculous. Your mother would never hurt you. Look, kid, I'm sorry. I hope she didn't do go too hard on you. She didn't even blame me, Charm. Sometimes I wish she had just thrown me out. At least then I wouldn't feel so guilty. She didn't even get mad. She just forgave me before I could even say I was sorry. But, kid, isn't that a, a good thing? No, I mean, I don't know. It would be so much easier if I didn't have to choose a side. Then don't. I don't need you fighting my battles. I already owe you my freedom. You don't owe me anything. Charm, what am I to you? Just an unpaid debt? Jeez, I'll pay you back, all right? That's not what I asked. You're not listening to me. Hmm, you're getting angry again. Just tell me what you want, kid. Stop calling me kid! I am not a kid! <laughs> listen, kid. No, you listen! Ooh, they're mad. Do you think you've been gone, huh? Huh? Oh, come on. Don't put me on the spot here. How long, charm? Um, well, let's see now. Um, one, one, two, three, four. It's been 84 years. Five. What are those numbers? Are you talking weeks, months? What is it, Charm? Yes, there's a difference. It's not all the same. Look, I'm not mortal. Time just doesn't feel the same for me. I mean, you know that, right? Yeah, I know. I just, it's, I've just missed you. Bring back a kissy face. <laughs> Even the psychopathic grin would be good at this point. <laughs> Don't be like that. Wish I wasn't happy to see you again. Sorry. A priest, huh? Better get used to it. Do you like being a priest? It's okay, I guess. It's kind of hard. They were. It's a, it's a bad. This world needs at least one good priest. Good priest charm? I am not considered one. <laughs> Suppose that means I prefer the bad ones. Can't tell if that's a compliment. 
Kid? Hmm? Do you know how Strange is doing? No, sorry. I see. I want to know how long it's been. She, she never talked to me like you did. Fine, don't worry about it, I understand. Your, your hands are cold. You want me to heat them? No, I don't mind. They're how I remember. A good memory? <laughs> I guess not. Care to explain why you punched me in the face right after I released you? It wasn't really the thanks I expected to get. It, it, it was um, a joke. What the heck? Look, I'm sorry, but there was no time to talk you out of coming with me. A harpy? That's so cool. You're too stubborn. I had to stop you somehow. It didn't even hit me hard. I just wasn't prepared for it. Besides, it wasn't the punch that hurt the most. I'm sorry. Why is she glitching? I have no idea. I apologize. Just give me a warning next time so I can beat you fair and square. Oh yeah, you think you can take me on, do you? Yeah, you're a real wimp. That's why you have to cheat. Don't cheat. I'm just creative with the rules. Yeah, that's called cheating. Hey kid. So um, do you love me? Um. Uh, so anyway, did you ever tell anyone about crabs or something back at the temple? Crabs? What are you talking about? Or was it cows? It's been bugging me for a while. I just can't get this word out of my head. I know it begins with C. C, 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 something. I swear you told me something about it. Wait, you're not a crab, are you? Or a cow, maybe. Is that it? I guess not. Well, whatever. I'm sure it's not that important or else I would have remembered, right? I think <laughs> she just... The kid just <laughs> tucked sure the head. Off. Yep. <laughs> oh, there I am. Oh my god, now you're going to pick up the freaking head and put it... Hey, kid, do you think you do me a favour? You see, I seem to be missing some limbs. All of them, in fact. How about giving me a hand or, or, or two? Thanks, kid. Just put me back on my body over there. How did I place... I don't know. Let's place Jam's head back on the body. Can't live on, can't live without them. Am I right? Mortals, I never understand them. Kid, tell me, what did I do wrong? Everything! Figured as much. Don't worry about it, though. She'll cool down eventually. Mortals always do. You mortals can only hold a grunge as long as you live. That's why you guys rarely held them for long. It's different when you just keep on living. Then the grudges tend to stick around forever. It's like that with her mother and me. After a while, you almost kind of forget why you don't get along. You just know you don't. You can always avoid dealing with it for another thousand years if you choose. But I feel I can't avoid it like this this time. For some reason, it feels like time's running out. Maybe that's just your mortality rubbing off on me. I don't know. Well, I guess we should keep moving. Ping! Game saved. Village of Gems. Ooh. Mana Surge! Wrong game. Ooh. Ooh. They have little arrows. What does the little arrowy thing mean? That you can go in there? Yeah, I guess <gasps> we'll go into this castle. The drunken feline! You got the drunken feeling. They were the drunken feeling. Shrine of an Undying Flame. Ooh. As, why, is, why is there a glowy octopus? It's a shrine of a Titan God. The inscription reads Plasma. Our Lord, born of the Sea of Chaos, Undying Flame. You pray? Yes. You prayed, but feel much the same. So, this is pointless. Yep. Well, I guess we keep going to the right. <laughs> yep, we go into that drunken feeling. 
Oh, with a drunken feeling. We've got to go in the drunken feeling, right? I, I guess we have to. The drunken feline. <sighs> Can we do some karaoke? There's open mic night. Oh, oh better not disturb. Oh, I'm looking them equally. Oh no. Laura Mipson, Dollar Sia Matt. Oh, they haven't put any any copy in that. It's just speaking Laura Mipson. Literally, that is just Laura Mipson. <laughs> and did they forget to put like speech in there? Mm, you can talk to the bartender cat. Maybe you could order a drink. What's your poison, Sunny? Hard and dirty, fruity with an umbrella, or information? Let's go with the information. There we go. Yeah. Look, Sonny, I don't know what kind of place you think this is. It's a bar. Bartender. I opened this place to get some peace and quiet. Fights and mortals don't cause any trouble. They don't even drink. Whenever you have a place that's too small, it will start to seem exclusive to people. And that's when the crowds come. Fine, too old for this. What's supposed to do? Say no to business. Now, what are you having? Strong and dirty or fruity with an umbrella. Who's Laura Mipsum? Um, it, it's, yeah, I'm assuming that's a joke. Um, but then if you're not a dev, maybe you don't know. It's basically default Latin text that some person invented that you put in as, like, example copy in a website or a game. And then, you know. All right, give it up for Tiniparus. Tiniparus Jones, everyone. He's here all week doing his thing, whatever it is. Next up, we're introducing a young and up-and-coming comic. Peaky, please give a warm welcome to... Dr. Banana! Funny Bones McGee. Give him a hand, everybody. Clap, 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 clap. Okay, we're thank out you, of this. Thank, thank you for coming out, everybody. Oh. Hmm. Sad face. Spoil sport. Village of Gems. Madison! Yes, leave town forever. The Sandom Lauren Ripson has been in use since the 1500s. Blimey, I did not know that. <gasps> it's the green one again. Truth! So, that was you? You okay? I saw you had some comics after you. You seem to have shaken them off though, that's good. It's been a long time, hasn't it? What have you been up to? Know anything about the others? I assumed everyone was captured, but both of us have managed to escape. Maybe others have as well? Charm. Yeah, sorry. What What are you doing here? I'm on my way to bust out Strange. You're busting Strange out too, right? I see. Truth? I mean, isn't that why you're here too? Why oh, yeah. that's unfortunate. Truth barrier. Heck, dude. Sorry, I can't make like make things even worse. What are you talking about? A scrudge with root. Ah, some healthy for all parties. It's time we make amends, not feel the fire. But you can't be having regrets about freeing the mortals. It's not about regret. We just handled it poorly. Fact is, we abandoned diplomacy, diplomacy, and we went behind Root's back. There's no other way. Anyone can be convinced with enough reason. If only you would have given me more time. I'm telling you, you can't reason with that old hag. No, ch oh, you can't reason with anyone. All you do is create tension. What is this? You wouldn't think you can keep me here. I think you best understand. <sighs> yeah, flickery circle is flickering. If you won't listen to me, perhaps you listen to plasma. Don't worry, I've arranged an escort for you, so please try and behave. Wow, well, truth. Truly are the worst part of me. Likewise. This little starfish. Kid, get me out of here! They're comets, Oh, they're comets, but they look like little starfish. But they're also immortal, so you know. There's some little mini suns as well. Oh, no, the suns is what they are when they're flying. Because they're spinning round so fast they look like sword blades. Truth barrier. Ah! Truth put up a truth barrier. Hmm. 
funny way, not funny. Oh my god, the shield this time. But maybe we can get the truth barrier down and then she'll give us a shield. So it seems like she's split into component parts, which represent attributes. Alright, I'm out. Now listen up, kid. Mortals won't stay down for long, but don't give up. If we bring them all down at the same time, we can make our escape while they're busy reforming. Now go! Target them specifically? No, not to my knowledge. There's only three. Hooray! Oh, hurry! Let's scram! <laughs> okay, apparently we're good. Bing, 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 bing. Yep. And we got an achievement. Blee! Bloop! Yep. <gasps> hmm. Just a minute, kid. Just have to um, take out the trash. <gasps> oh, well, let's just carry on. Boing. You little worm, you think I didn't see you there? Oh, don't do this, Charm. Don't disturb what you. Oh, what you little. Plasma's little zap dog now. Charm, cut it out. Just listen to me. Can't believe I was worried about you. Oh, all right. I yield. Please get off me. Sorry. Whatever. There's no point in fighting among ourselves. So, where have you been? Are oh, we were taken to Plasma, all three of us? Three? Yeah, up, down, and myself. And Beauty? Beauty? What do you mean? Wasn't Beauty with you and Strange? No. But, but that doesn't make sense. So, Beauty was supposed to be with us, huh? Yeah, that was the idea. They split us equally between them. Plasma would take three, and... Root the others, I see. It's obvious they didn't want us all in one place. But somehow Beauty got away. What about the others? Are they okay? I seem content. This one's pretty lenient with us. It's almost like as if we're prisoners in New Morning. The what, you can't... You can just leave whenever you want? Not quite, but even if that were the case, you know how the others are. They don't uh, have the same kind of drive as someone like you. And what about you? Are you content with this? I just want to find a solution. I'm tired of fighting. Content, huh? There's no way I could be content with the way things are. Charm. Freeing the mortals out of some colour to the world, I don't regret that. But too much colour and things start getting chaotic. Freeing can be a burn as well. Maybe it's better to leave the immortals as they are. Maybe not free, but content. Look, can we just focus on getting everyone back together again? Oh, I am. I'm just treading my own path to get there. You're free to do the same. I'd rather beat you into submission, honestly. Come on, I'm just kidding. Unless... Goodbye, charm. We Hold on! I, it's just... Take care, right? Yeah, you too. Hey, just a question, because I'm curious. Huh? That thing behind you? Damn. Oh, that's just my little buddy. Yeah, a little buddy. Yeah, I think it's a crab or something. Maybe not. <laughs> I'm sorry. You must be really lonely. Hey, you had a whole crew of babysitters following you. I think I'm allowed at least one. Besides, my babysitter totally beat up your babysitter. So who's laughing now? Yeah, I think this is my cue to leave. <laughs> this game is really silly. It's something. So do we reckon we're going to do the whole story? Possibly. We get all the achievements. That would be nice. Unusual. <gasps> so you can fly on the puff bloom things. Yeah. <gasps> Evil cat. 
cat. <gasps> Slime post! Like Hush and dead end. Oh. Maybe the other one said caution lava, but you just couldn't read it because you'd need the fire thing. Which is probably better than help when trapped in lava. Oops. Banana! Oh, hey! Hey, you! I remember you. It's me. Do you remember me? Do you? Banana bun! Mm, sorry, I didn't quite get that. My ears are bananas. Oh, it's Banana Max. Okay. So you do know my true identity. Well, it doesn't matter. I'm not coming back. The League of Extraordinary Gentle Fruits has to do without me. When I lost my faithful psychic cranberry boy, I swore never to don the cape again. How can I protect the world if I can't even protect those closest to me? Ooh. Oh my god, it's the ghost of Cranberry Boy! Who's there? It's me, Ralph! Ah, uh, Cranberry Boy, it's you, but I thought you were dead! Yes, I'm a ghost now. Ooh. Oh, thank god. <laughs> I'm afraid I might have buried you alive! If he says you did, I'm going to crack up. <laughs> you did. You did do that. I remember it like it was yesterday. I was on break from work, just eating a sandwich by the roadside. Then you showed up. You held me down, screaming, I shall avenge you, my sweet cranberry, as you shoveled dirt into my face and everything went dark and cold. Yes, it was very emotional. <laughs> Please don't beg me to come back. I now live a simple life with my banana wife and banana child. I've moved on from my past as a fighter for justice, as an arbiter of justice, as a justice for justice. You murdered me, curse you, banana man. You're a bad man. Curse we you. Jesse. I think we broke Jesse. So it has come to this. If even people beyond the grave are returning, it seems the world really needs me. <sighs> Take a hint, Max. I shall break my oath. For you, Cranberry Boy. I shall don the cape once more and become the hero you always looked up to and admired all throughout your short, pathetic life as a nobody. <laughs> Banana Max! Okay. okay so Kate, Kate means that he can fly. The slug's just there. Wit. 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 Where are you going, dude? Wrong way. Ah, uh, fuck it. I'll do it on my own. It's the blue bees! They're very depressed. Delayed sound effects. All right, two minutes, thirty seconds. Excuse me. Jesse, this is like Joe level in an aptitude. Oh, there is a ceiling on that move. Okay. Yeah, the ceiling has spikes. Well, I've been really close to the spikes a few times, and it didn't do anything. Yeah, the hitbox is really good on them. But if you go right into it, then it's gonna die. Oh, are you seeing if there's something up here? I figured it was a little odd. Ooh. 
secret area. The third piece! If we found the first and the second. I've got the first. <laughs> we miss a bit. It's a black slime! Oh no! It's my shadow self. It's like Shadow Link, but a slime or slug. Did we die? Crystal I'm just gonna assume I don't need it. Cool. I hope not, because that would be really embarrassing. <laughs> oh no, the perfume. Yeah, if we ever do like real commentary, you're gonna have to like share your screen on Discord because like the delay I'm sure is excruciating. You could kill the bees. Probably. <gasps> is that a puppy? <gasps> I am good dog! So call me lost dog. Please call me good dog. Good dog! Who's a good boy? Who's a good boy? Yes, I am. I am a good boy. Dogs. Cats. Hey, Sub. Yeah. Hi, Sub. I think most people probably Hi. used... You broke the bounds of the box. Uh, so... I think most people just used Boss Rush. Probably. Just take me for a walk. I'm now mimicking the name of the, the, the voice of the dog from up. My name is Doug. Okay, my good boy. <gasps> Sandcastle! <gasps> no, it's a box fort! I love it. I want one. Where are we supposed to go? Do you need the dog to blow you so you can go up? I'm going to guess I need up. to take care of these cats. Oh, okay. Hello, Subterfuge. I am the voice in Jesse's head. Ooh. Good work, ancient good dog. I see you've met the rookie. <laughs> Just according to plan. Plan. I know, Leaky. I heard it too. <laughs> that castle gate down there sure looks heavy. It's just cardboard, boss. I bet you could lift it up and slip in under. No worries, we'll get that thing open for you. No problem. See you inside. Like the triangle did. Yes. <laughs> I know what you meant. It's the game that's rude, not me. Cardboard castle! I just let you in! Why is it attacking you? No, the rebel group let me in. Oh. It feels like this is like a lava moment, but no. Her work is a Hellsinger is on Game Pass. What is Hellsinger? It is. It is, John. Metal Hellsinger. Yeah, it's the new rhythm shooter. Oh. Does that mean we need to request it? No. Oh. No. I just hadn't decided if I was going to play it yet. Oh, okay. Because I have, like... <laughs> Crime. It's apparently Not really good. John has said it's really good. Ah. Oh. <laughs> Intruders, I commend you for making it this far, but now you must face the top two members of the King's Elite Guard. Prepare to... Oh, a dog. 
Why did you tell me there was a dog here? What's the matter? I can't handle a cute little doggy boggy. Are you scared? You <laughs> little scaredy cat baby boo boo. No, I'm just a legit dog slobber. Well, I am a little scaredy cat baby boo boo, so I'm not going anywhere near that thing. <laughs> oh. Um. How about a friendly game of Yarny Ball instead? Sure. Well, I mean, if we've paid for Game Pass already, technically we paid for the game. Are you good at Yarny Ball? You're good at wet. Ew, we slobbered all over it. Soundtracks. This go on a while. Oh no! Oh no! Oh no! Yeah, because apparently it's just not it's not just a touching the ground once, it's gotta to touch the ground a lot. Yes! You got a point! Well and I think with the like the Ball physics. Where did you pause? You're reading the chat. Yes. I can read the chat too if you like. Fine. The red cat grows a little devil cat when it's doing the little rush thing. No, 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 I, I don't get it. I thought you just dropped the ball already, cats. The ball's hit the ground a bunch of times. One point now. I think you only need two. Okay. Right, one. No. No, I just need to win two zero. Oh yes, I know that I was counting how many times I hit the ground. One. No. Two. There we go. Three. No! No, me. You win. Okay, you win. Fair and square, except for the part where you cover the ball in dog slobber. She didn't win fair, you only won square, which doesn't even make sense. So maybe you didn't actually win. I think everybody lost today, to be honest. No rematch. Well, I guess you can go ahead to the king. Just please, no more slobbering. Good boy bouncing on the spikies. I feel like there's a pro tip regards spikies. That says PO tip. Clearly, good boy is immune to spikies. Pro tip. Don't die. Pro tip. Don't run into the spikes. The bowl is clearly broken. Who got me this bowl? They shall go to the dungeon.
The slug. Of course it's a slug. It has little antennae. It's cute. Who yeah. put this cucumber by my back? <gasps> oh my god! <laughs> Was it the dog? Wow. This dog. We're going full meme here. Okay. Ah, uh, yeah, 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 yeah. Yeah. Yes, yes. I'm a good dog. Yeah, 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 yeah. Good dog. Bah. No such thing. Off to the dungeon with you. Get. You meow to your grace. God, remind me who got me into this. Who got me this bowl? The bowl, your grace. Yes, this bowl is defect. Ah, I see. I should throw that immediately. Never mind, God, that can wait. For now, please. Oh, I'm a cucumber. cucumber. Okay. And this, this dumb dog slave to the dungeon. Um, before that, Your Grace, we need to ask you. What now, God? Well, it's just, you know how you always call me God, Your Grace? Yes, you'd be God, I'd be King. Mm, yes, of course, you are correct, Your Grace, but, um, you know, um, I think I just feel more comfortable being addressed by my given name if it's not too much to ask, Your Grace. Fine, state your name, God. It's Mr. Whiskers, Your Grace. Mr. Whiskers? Ah, music to my ears. Just like that, Your Grace. Thank you. Now then, please honour me with your request once more. These criminals, they are to be escorted to the dungeon immediately. Certainly, Your Grace. Now, what charge would that be? Charge? It's what heinous crime have they committed against the kingdom? What's the matter? You defying your king, Mr. Whiskers? Oh, no, not at all, not at all, Your Grace. But, but, well, it's just the dungeons are getting quite full, Your Grace. Quite, quite full. Full? Yes, full, Your Grace. Just sit out, Mr. Whiskers, or I'll have your claws trimmed. Y y yes, Your Grace. I'm a king of mercy. I've decided to spare you the dungeon. But your sneaky ways must not go unpunished. See this armor? I always wear this armor day and night. But it's not because it won't come off no matter what I try. Not the reason. I just like having it on all the time. It doesn't bother me one bit. It's fine. Understand? As long as I have my armor shooting me, won't do a thing. Now let's play ball. But up with me. Because I'm not shaped like a ball or anything, so yeah, understand. Don't think of me as a ball that you can jump or dash into when I'm vulnerable. Actually, forget I said. He's now covered in slobber. <laughs> oh no. Where's where where where's where's, where's wizard? And her 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 little um. King. Ooh, well that did some damage. Oh, ah! We're just, we're just playing cat volleyball again. Yes, but at least something is happening and there is a bar. And if you yeet them into the spikes, it's really good. God! Ow. Now the guards are throwing joints at you. Possibly fiery arrows. I'm unsure. Oops. Did you get squashed? I did. Do we have to go through all that again? I hope not. <laughs> he just did himself some damage. It was fake damage. Don't. Okay. Don't think of me as a ball. You can yeet into the spikes. I am not a ball. I am a cute fluffy kitten in this armor, which I totally could take off if I wanted to. I'm not stuck. I didn't eat so really much not. that I get out of my armor. Does this slobber actually do any damage or does it make it blue? God! If it makes it blue, that makes it vulnerable for me. Ah. So it's got to be slobbered on, and then you can eat. Yeah. Yeet! Oops. Uh, nope. No, 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 no. There we go, there we go. We can yeet now. Oh no, oh no, oh no, oh no. Also. Two and a half seconds left. Oh, that's Yeet! Gods, what are you doing? Shoot them, you fools! 
Fly, fools. Fly. Not so fast. We're the terror of the status quo. Ren and Osh will be your woe. We'll sneak into your bed at night and stab you in the back. That's right. Left guy Bill, right guy Ben, and me and Lavender, their famous leader. <laughs> That's my army! Down with the king! Reminds me of Team Rocket. Now there's too many things flying around, and I've got no idea what's funny. Uh, I what's think they up. killed the king. Okay, we're good. Hey, rookie! The king's tyranny is finally over, but our work has only just begun. Now we rebuild, we build a better society! How? Don't keep me hanging! <laughs> Can we take a nap first? Definitely second the nap. Yes, first we take a nap, then we rebuild the city! I like this plan. Agent Good Dog, with you as our ambassador, perhaps you can finally bridge a peace between our kingdoms. Yes, I am Good Dog. No more, my friend. I'm promoting you to Agent Best Dog. <gasps> hey guys, why can't you be more like Agent Best Dog here? What you mean, be more like an idiot? Yeet! What about you, Rookie? What will you do now? Is this the end? No, we've still got to find truth, charm. Strange! Will you stay? I'll give you a position in my cabinet. No, you don't need to explain. I understand. It's not just you. You are a free and wandering soul. I see it in your eyes, Rookie. I see the eyes of the windows to the soul. And yours are like um, tiny black nondescript stops of potential. I'll never forget you, Rookie, and I hope you won't fight. Forget the time you spent in the dust of my army. I salute you, my friend. I salute you. Down the great big void of doom. Into the toilet. Bloop, the bloop, sewers. Bloop. I was right. But I actually have to call stream. Oh, no. I know. I completed the request. I played the game. Oh, I want to find out if we rescue Strange. We've still got two achievements left. <laughs> Let's see. The, the name thing. of the game was Wizard and the Slug. You've got to defeat Root, which feels more like a game. I mean, it's fine. You have to go and eat. I have to go and sleep. I have to go pick up the food. Oh. Yeah. It's just been fun. I've never done voices not on my own stream. <laughs> Let's see. Let's see if we can find somebody to raid. Today. Um, have Vor's live? Vor's always live. Yeah. He's taking care of the kangaroo. Hmm. Yeah. A while. And doing musical chairs. Do 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 do. Manim manim ba ba da ba. We'll read the Avian Art channel. We're doing uh, the final group race of a musical chairs for their tourney. Who's commentating? What? What does that mean? Uh, there was this meme tourney called the Avian Art, and it was... Uh, Ridiculous and silly, and they're in a... The musical chairs idea was you start off with four people, mm -hmm. and all four people have to race together. 
only the last place gets eliminated from each race. Okay. So. Is this linked to the past? Yeah. Okay. It's a meme tourney race. So. It would help if I could smell avian. Yeah, this is why I wish it was easier to, like, rate the thing. Well, if you have a lot of friends, it's not easy. Uh, back on Friday, you know the spiel. Bye, everybody. He's been Jesse! I was Joe, the voice in his ear, and hopefully not too annoying. See you later! <laughs> that was funny.